Speakers, mm. episode 108. Stop. Yo, chilling, busting my flow. Uh. Give a fuck about uh. these dumb man. Uh. Uh. Y'all know my name. name. My name is Shard. Shard. Uh, they call me what? Shard the God. God. You know. <laughs> <laughs> Hey, quick, I want to tell you, man. Y'all hey, boy got some jackets on. These niggas right here, man. Hey, man. Hey, I know y'all remember this. These niggas ain't never been on the JV. They went straight they to the what? Bo- the varsity. God damn right, the man. Boss. Straight to the varsity. All, all, all American slang on 1973 champion, man. <laughs> 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 MVP, nigga. MVP. I see the MVP hey, on the man. left arm. I was arm, averaging 15, man. You know, Straight to the varsity. Hey, man. Hey, man. Welcome to another Dynasty episode, episode 108. If yes, you sir. haven't subscribed, please subscribe. Check yes, us out on yes, YouTube, sir. Yes, sir. Spotify, yes, sir. Facebook, mm-hmm. Instagram, all that. TikTok. Yes, sir. Keep going. Snapchat. Yeah. All of that. We in there. Man, yes, sir. Podcast. Hey, man. How was y'all weekend? Well, I went major that weekend. Oh, hold on, hold on. My bad. I'm your host, G Downs. Your boy, Sean. No, it's your boy, Cup. It's your neighbor Skeet. I'm Neighborhood. Back. Skeet back, man. We had to call Labor Fine and tell him about needs. I was like, you ran out of PTO day last week. <laughs> your PTO is up. <laughs> we had a lot going on, y'all. See, I got the white shades on, you know. Yes, sir. Uh, you on some bad speaker type shit today. Let's, Let's get, get it. it. But yeah, man, we gonna, we, we gonna kick this off the right way today, man. Mm-hmm. Is attention the most powerful currency on earth yeah yeah on well, this flat earth I, I, I wish they sold it at walmart man mm. i buy everybody some of that shit, man on me i pass it out like turkeys at thanksgiving man <laughs> uh, I, I, it two types of attention though you might one might be cursed and one can get your ass spanked yeah two different types of attention now what you that's mean? true to me you're like you can you can get attention by you know m- motherfucker want to go viral i yeah. can sit here and just talk random i could pick somebody's favorite whatever that talk shit about them yeah. And then go viral. I'm getting the attention, mm. but I'm also getting that person's attention. Yeah. So if I ain't about what I'm talking about, that'd be the wrong attention. Mm. Man, I think I think attention right now is the root of all evil. Oh. None of this generation, nobody has no no ambitions or goals to actually do something. They just want to look like something and show something. And as long as everybody can see them, Nothing else really matters. That shit sad, bro. I'm just being nah, for real I, I right see now. What you're saying. I like think, yeah. motherfuckers out here doing crazy shit. I don't know if y'all remember. It was a long time ago. It was a nigga that went up in uh, Chick Fil A, took off all his clothes, bro. Stood up on the fucking counter and and poured a milkshake over his body to get a million views. But I about to say you remember him now, don't you? Mm-hmm. Right. We don't know his name. That's what I'm saying. But you remember though, the But that's act. what I'm saying. We do. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> I I think going viral will play success. I think now that's the new thing to do. If you can go viral, young folks don't give a fuck about being successful no more. Like they want they want the attention. They want to be viral. They want when you walk out there know that and that man right there let everybody slap him for a hundred dollars. You know what I'm <laughs> saying? Like so that's so that's the new success. Look, look that's the, the new look success. At the root going word viral. though, viral. When has a virus ever been good? I'm not the guy. Y- y- I said you niggas want to go viral, but usually going viral gets you in a, a fucked up situation nine times out yeah. of ten. If you don't know how to do what you need to do, well, it depends on what you're going viral for, though. So you showed me a clip other time of uh, uh, a white boy calling Ti and them a, a boy. Oh yeah, yeah, but it, yeah, oh, I forgot his name. He like got his ass dropped out there. Yeah, I'm gonna got his ass blitz, man. Uh, <laughs> look, if a person can tweet something or say something. And everybody in the world sees it. That person is the most powerful person in the world. Oh, and that's just the truth. If if it becomes a person out here that can say something and everybody in the world sees it, or everybody in the world retweets it, that's the most powerful person in the world. So you're like, yeah, attention is like the new currency because you can get paid off of how much attention is on you. Right now, we get four hundred thousand subscribers. Some shit like that, and we keep building, building. That's more powerful. We gonna get. We gonna keep getting more powerful and powerful and powerful. The more attention our platform is is, is drawing. So that's True. what people get paid off of now. Is the attention? What your numbers are? Everything based off numbers. Everything. Bro, you know I, 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 I 100% agree with you, and I'm gonna tell you why. I mean to cut you off. The reason everything he's saying is so accurate right now. Think about it. Who the most powerful person on earth in business? Preachers. Because they got a whole congregation 
that a, that a, that they have their attention that a vouch for them on anything. It don't it don't matter what they do. A pastor could rape somebody. Don't talk about my pastor. I don't know about that now. Shit. shit. Well, you're going to get your ass up out that pool pit now. Man, listen, listen, <laughs> you get man, doing I'm, all I'm, that, I'm, man. I'm, I'm I'm a a nah, bro. It's, it's, some, it's some preachers out here I get you, I get doing, some, doing some fucked up shit. But because, they, because his congregation, which some people call a cult, believe in what he's saying so much, it don't matter what he do. They going to overlook it, bro. That's the most powerful thing. If somebody got your mind, that's the most powerful thing to have, bro. If you got, when you got people paying attention to you and doing whatever you say, that's the most powerful shit on earth to me, bro. Mm. I to think have I, somebody following and listening to, like he said, to everything that you do, no matter what you do, you got somebody following that shit, bro. Man, I think attention is a drug, man. It is? Like, like you got women getting on line, half naked for that shit. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? Men, you know, doing all type of shit outside their character for that shit. You know what I'm saying? Like that shit, that shit a drug. Folk fiend for that. Yeah, and then they're making it too where like you can't say nothing about it either. Like, right. Like how, like now, everything bad is good. I ain't trying to go deep into it, but like if a girl get online, show her, show her ass assets, you know, or on camera doing an OnlyFans, but we know what happens on OnlyFans. Mm -hmm. If I sit up here and say a woman shouldn't be doing that. It's gonna be a hundred thousand motherfuckers saying, "Why are you judging her?" Or this and that. Or if a dude mm -hmm. yep. get online doing dumb shit, like you say, pouring milkshakes on their body, you know what I'm saying? You got the Island Boys a couple months ago, Blood Brothers kissing yeah. each other. Yeah, you see what I'm saying? <laughs> and shit like that for attention and stuff like that. Like now, if somebody, even if something like that situation, if somebody say something about it, it's it's, it's gonna be two or three motherfuckers saying, like I seen. Well, I nah. seen Joe Smith. You know basketball. Him and his wife? Yeah. His and that's his fault, though. Huh? That's his fault. Man, no. It's his fault. He let her record her and say, you knew who I was when you got me. He did. But get what? That was his fault. Yeah. But who no. was she? A porn star? <laughs> no. Man. I would have slapped that goddamn phone out of her hand. Oh, what's her name, bro? <laughs> what's her name? Uh, uh, what's her name? I tried Keisha to... Chavis? Hey, it's like 60 Ke years Keisha old. Keisha Chavis. She's yeah. like 60 she years old. She got an OnlyFans. She busting that one Bust that motherfucker wide open. I tried, Joe. I tried, Joe. I tried, Joe. Huh? That's the embarrassing part about She's it. She's 60. Nah, no, I don't she know how old she is, she but she's old as shit, though. To be but, having OnlyFans. But, 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 but we getting off such. I'm going to say this, though. Right. I'm going to say this, though, real quick. All right. I told y'all niggas, man, them, them niggas in the NBA, them professional athletes be lame as fuck. Man, she was a porn star when he met her, bro. And now you want to complain? Talking about some, you, uh, and all this other shit. You done blow through 100 million. You know what I'm saying? You went, yeah. you could have had any woman you want, and you went and picked a porn star because you probably watched the video of her goddamn giving the best throat you ever seen in your life, probably. Come on, man. That's no, baby. Joe Fox. I'm trying That's to Joe Fox. Did you hear how she talked? Hey, she talked to her like, why are you going back? Oh, oh my God, Joe. I'm like, you, you knew this motherfucker were retarded. You knew how she talked. She but get what, though? She didn't have that camera phone at first. She was just fucking doll hell out him in the room. <laughs> yeah, she yeah. was she tearing your ass yeah. up. But can I ask you though? Okay, I know that this is totally off subject, yeah. but is it him on the OnlyFans? No. Mm -mm. Nah. No. You, you see her? I think I done found the boy. <laughs> <laughs> let, let me see if, if she valid. I heard this on the radio. Yeah, it's she valid. And then she say her bodies don't her bodies in the work don't count. What the fuck? She what? Said, she said her bodies, when it comes to work, mean like porn and shit, don't count. Oh, hell yeah. You ain't got damn say what? You ain't get painted like a butt. Hey, I, look, man. Get what? Don't, 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 don't start me with that type but shit. But that's my point. Like, the, it's, the, it's the attention. First of all, Joe Smith. Oh, damn, I'm from the, damn, Joe. I was fucking with you. Now I got the dog. You good. Cause you weren't even that good. You should have definitely knew better than to get it's old. The attention, it's the attention, cuz. It's the attention is the number one currency in the world. If right now one of us become, if one of us say something, and that shit goes everywhere, and and that person can say anything. That person is the Elon Musk, man. Like people like that. You know what I'm saying? Like yeah. you, you is the most powerful person in the fucking world. Well, he bought Twitter, did he? He bought the whole platform. What you talk on? Yeah. So it's damn. He bought it, 56 million or some shit like that. That's how much money this nigga got. Crazy. Only one person got more money than him, that's Bernard I know. And he owns 
uh, all the fashion brands. He own Louis Vuitton, Gucci, Prada. He own all that shit. He mm-hmm. own like like you know he's the most richest person in the world. But he just passed Elon Musk this year. But Elon Musk gonna pass him again next year. So it really don't matter. But that what I'm saying. Like that attention shit, shit, man. And then just like now, we said it before. Kanye West said it, man. It ain't it ain't the nigga down the street that got your bitches. Instagram got your bitch. Right. That's a fact. Instagram got your bitch. <laughs> All you niggas out there but the whole Instagram don't pick up your girl picture and start putting that shit on the explore page. It's over. They sure got that It's over, my G. Soon, soon, soon as they put your girl picture on the I know a girl right now. You used to tell her ass up, swear to God. I done showed all y'all this motherfucker. This bitch got 30,000. When, when, I, when I met her, she was at like 900. Boy, one day they explore page, picked the page, picked the, picked the picture up. You know what I'm saying? Sent that shit out to everybody. Man, this motherfucker now got like 30,000 likes. Won't pick up the phone no more. Boy, you, boy, I had one in high school, but. <laughs> But I'm talking about, but hey, shout out to my fan Ryan. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> Falling through the crib, we carved her, nigga. I'm talking about carved her, yeah. punkin style, like went crazy. Yeah. She, she came over in her volleyball with Letterman, nigga. Yeah. Like, I swear to God, that bitch been in the Rick Ross videos and everything. Yeah. Yeah. I tried to double back. Yeah. Boy, it's over with. No love, <laughs> boy. And she reaming. I'm, I'm telling you, bro. Let, let that Instagram pick up your girl picture and put that reel up on that goddamn explore. It's over with, boy. Man, how you think them girls be Instagram and stuff that made for a female? A nigga got to be talented. A girl ain't got to be shit but fine. Thanks. Fine and thick. Yeah, so. You got to be a comedian. You got to be a rapper. You got to be, nigga, you got to know how to tell jokes and make skits to be that nigga on IG or some shit like that. That's a fact. You be sick one. Uh, uh, you can't even be sick. <laughs> you might just die. Yeah, just die. Yeah, fuck y'all, boy. Hell, <laughs> <laughs> you gotta just be dying. <laughs> dying, bro. But if your ass is goddamn a girl, only thing she gotta be is fine online. And Instagram know that shit. That's why they taking them girls shit up through that like that. You see what I'm saying? That's they a fact. They ain't picking up your picture, nigga. You gotta do some shit. You gotta got. I gotta fall off the bed. Why bro. you think Boom Gang went so crazy with all that shit he was doing? No, y'all remember that nigga? Yeah, years yeah, ago? yeah. No, taking folks shit, and taking ran. folks shit, running and Boom Gang, all that dumb shit. Cause get what? That it, it was it, for a nigga. That's the equivalent of a girl looking good online. Right. You gotta go up through that. That's sad. Saying? But if your girl posts the right picture tomorrow, it's over. And enough motherfuckers stop and look of her friends, and they throw that motherfucker on the explore page. It's over with. Thirty thousand, thirty thousand by the morning. She taking that motherfucker down. Know what she gonna do? <laughs> but, but what I'm saying is, Instagram got your bitch from that point on. Facts. She locked. Do that make me secure she, though? If I want her to take it down. Yeah. Cause, Cause my thing is, if you got a real woman, she gonna know. Look, man. If a girl posts a picture that's provocative and shit on on IG doing all that shit, man, she advertising. I don't care what y'all niggas say. Yeah. Say I'm insecure. Say whatever. But every day, you putting on the outfit in the closet. Just to go in front of your long mirror, there's a body link. Just, to, just, to, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. Like, yeah. She, 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 she advertising. Like, you know what you're doing? You when put they, you when that extra right. tight shit showing them prints, but then when yeah. they get mad when niggas leave provocative messages. <laughs> Fuck you. Mm-hmm. You right? You shouldn't have put it on. Yeah, man. But <laughs> got that attention, man. It's a motherfucker, man. It's a motherfucker, man. But yeah. Boy, you got this shit spread out today, boy. Yeah, man. You know, we just, we just going. Fuck it, man. We going to the NBA right now, man. Mm. Okay. James Harden. I, I know. Folk I do not fear Harden. the beard anymore. <laughs> you don't fear uh, the beard? No, I don't. Uh, I want to know what y'all think about this trade. They talking about they got a big four. The four horsemen ain't clipping shit. Bars. That was deep. Yeah, that, that was deep. Bars. I like that. I like uh, that. What kind of, you think it was a good move for the Clippers? And how deep? Pauls, you think they can go in the Western Conference with this team? Paul, that was a big Paul. Good, 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 yeah. good Paul. Who the fourth dude? Exactly. Him. <laughs> he is. Brooks, he, the, Karn, he, yeah. Paul Leonard, Paul Pierce. Paul, I mean, Paul uh, George. I think the Clippers gave and, up and, too and, and now he's a third mm. option. He may, he, he may be a fourth if Russell keep playing good. I just think they gave up too damn much. They gave up, what, like two round, two, two they rounds? They gave up a lot of shit. They got, they got P.J. Tucker <laughs> we gonna, gonna start acting like PJ Tucker and just you know what I'm saying I don't know what y'all see that I ain't seen but oh that boy shoe game ridiculous yeah I man, he know more listen. for his shoe than basketball but he be fresh on the court but what do he do on the court <laughs> he be fresh defense, man the man paid 20 minutes the other day and had zero zero and two attempts he's a defensive specialist yeah but you gonna see what he did to he's, KD. He's, he's, five he's, ten uh, KD he's stepped on the line he's Bruce Boy he was on that nigga hey he's he's Bruce 
He took the Bucks to the championship. That might be disrespectful, bro. <laughs> but he took the but Bucks though, to the championship. Though. Every every team he don't played on, they they do good though. With what, his presence. What, what the Sixers do last year? They they what they make it to the uh they, they made it to made the, the house. The they made it to the house. Well, a lot of niggas went home. And, and they were right beside you. But uh I don't I don't I don't I don't even know if he could fit with them. I don't know if they played together yet or not, but I can't see it. He hurt, ain't it? I don't know. Yeah, I mean, I'm yeah. just trying to figure out what is going to be his actual role. I ain't gonna lie to now, you. now, if James go back to being the six man, he he might be hell. Man, if James he gonna go back to being the six man, if he don't get over there and go crazy, I'm I'm through with James Hart. I'm gonna mm. tell you that now. You don't you know, play with everybody but LeBron James at this point. Nigga been on. Y'all yeah, know this. Listen, y'all know this. Ain't won not a ring yet. Hold on, this man. Y'all realize this man been on. Four teams in the last five years. This is what I just told you. He don't play with everybody but LeBron James. Mm. He don't play with KD. He don't play with Russ twice. Yeah. KD twice. Mm. Kyrie once. Mm. Got, now they got Kawhi. And B. Keep a, and, and B. You gonna keep a what? And B. He gonna keep a K. He gonna keep a. He gonna keep a. <laughs> man, Fabio Harden is turning up his click. He. I don't yeah. really think he cares. Nothing <laughs> <about. laughs> going on in the NBA right now. This yeah. nigga is over there in France wearing weird shit with little baby. Bro. He does not care. Yeah, I'm about to say that. I say that. That's about about, none of this who, who did that say? Don't think he dedicated you only, to his. You going. only left Philly because Buddy was busting your girl or uh, and married to Kelly Oubre. That's the only reason he oh, left. Uh, break it down, Ski. Kelly Oubre, yeah, that. putting that. Putting that light skin stroke on him, man. <laughs> no. That's what was going I on. I don't know that. It ain't about that. Fuck, you know, Jane don't care, man. Jane got a whole bunch of money, man. But, man, that nigga can do what he want to do. Yeah. He ain't studying that shit, but he wasn't going to be on the team, that nigga fucking that old yeah. bitch now. Yeah. I ain't yeah, gonna, I nah, we ain't going to play the old type game. Yeah, we ain't going to hoop together now. Nigga, I need to go a whole nother coast, nigga. I don't even want to play <laughs> on the same coast. We need to go a whole nigga. nother coast, nigga. Uh, I, I think the trade was what, what it was, man. I got to see them play together. Yeah. I mean, Kawhi got to be healthy. It's a lot of different factors with the Clippers. Man, James going to give you 18 and 10. Yeah, I don't think. Yeah, and, and they're going to lose in the second he, round. He, he ain't coming off the bench. Um, Kawhi's going to say he can't play every other game. <laughs> then PG's going to get hurt, and Russ going to take it upon himself to try to lead the team because 4 PF Hart is over there bullshit. <laughs> That's what the fuck's going to happen in the second round. They're going to lose to the Dallas Mavericks. And I'm going to be mad as hell. Y'all let their white boy back y'all down and beat y'all ass. Yeah. I think that they he ain't gonna come out of bed. He make too much money. <laughs> but you you just gave a rundown. That nigga ski just named they whole season. They gonna lose to the <laughs> bro. Y'all heard it. If they lose to the Dallas Maverick in the second round, bro, you called that shit, you bro. Called, I, I, you, I can't even lie to you, bro. Man, I play with everybody, hey, but Giannis, LeBron, and AD, <laughs> and stuff. Yeah, he ain't yeah, played with stuff. Yeah. yeah. But shit, he trying. See, he working his way though. Yeah. Uh, ain't no way I would have went to Miami, nigga. If you gonna trade me. Yeah, I think the trade is what it is. They lost a lot of defense on that trade. Honestly, they lost down there. Everybody that can play D other than Kawhi. But we seen Kawhi and Paul George can't stop nobody at this point in their career. Right. But they older now. Now, as far as the who's gonna play, Russ gonna keep coming out of the bench. He's playing good off the bench. Yeah. Uh, right now, anyway, uh, Jane Harden gonna have to start. He's a ball handler. That's just what it is. He ain't gonna come off no bench. He the best. Player to be the point guard mm -hmm. for them. For them. You know what I'm saying? Six foot five, my point guard six five. I got Paul George and Kawhi six seven six eight on the wings. Shit. We scrape. This, really. this, this remind me of a unit when they had Ron Harper, Michael Jordan, Scottie Pippen. Well, who the hell is you? <laughs> that, that, no, I'm, I'm, I'm saying that those are talk. They got, they got uh, uh, big guards. In the starting okay. five, okay. Oh, right. okay. that's, what, that's what I'm saying. <laughs> oh, right. 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 They right. all right. six five right. and up. Right. Hey, right. Hey, right. Right. Hey, right. Who am right. 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 I? I don't know right. Harper. No, which one of them is gonna be Mike though? <laughs> <laughs> oh, no, no, no. Hey, hey, hey! In the playoff, man, you should have like, said Ron Harper, Scottie Pippen, and Tony Kukoc. Or I Judd just Bush. Bush. I just said Judd Bush. No, I'm, I'm just speaking in the perspective. Judd Bush. No, I'm, I'm just speaking in the perspective of you know big guards. Randy club. Brown, like man. six five and up. You gotta think about it. like Mike was six six. Scottie was like six seven six eight. My, Ron Harper was like six seven. You know I ain't gonna lie. Four P or her, you get your ass out there this year. I know them down clip and get the bullshit, and nigga. And you at home, get back out there in Cali, nigga. God damn, like play for real. I know yeah. little baby be sitting there telling your ass, like, nigga, I ain't finna keep got down. Yeah. <laughs> keep the shit, you out there. Hey, boy, nigga. time to take that chain back. Bro, why I go hang with Giannis or somebody, nigga? You on his bullshit. <laughs> you ain't got but yeah. a couple more years. Yeah. 
I know you want a ring. Right now, you don't make the bread. What y'all see in Tucker, man? Why y'all keep acting like this? <laughs> man, that nigga shoe game. Man, man, I, I, that, I, ain't man. Like my, I ain't never seen nobody play. I'm going to ask you a question. I ain't never seen nobody play a good enough de- good defense on Katie like he did that year when them. Uh, uh, what his name is? Bucks. Bucks. The Bucks beat them, man. He I mean, I give you that. I give you that. I give you that. But, bro. Like, why don't right? But that's all he do. He's like, like you know who Bruce Bowen is? Yeah. Yeah. I know disrespect to Bruce Bowen. Bruce Bowen got a couple rings. I'm just saying, like man, that was dirty. He didn't. Player. He didn't. He didn't no, have no other stats. Bruce though. Bowen a dirty player. My nigga, uh, fresh kicks ain't no dirty player. <laughs> no, that's your new name, cuz Fresh kick. Now I gave you that. <laughs> he got. The, now he was playing some shit the other day. They ain't never seen him. Well, I ain't never, never seen him. see that nigga. Now, I will say, like Tucker ain't got that D like he used to. He like 37, 30, whatever the fuck he yeah, is. Yeah, yeah. He ain't dinging up niggas like that. No, he was in Houston playing for um yeah. Jay Hardy and Chris Paul. Them, then yeah, he was locking niggas up. Yeah, he was locking niggas up, he but he can't lock them up by a damn son. Yeah, Capella was pretty much young. Yeah, so yeah. well, we got G man. All right, we gonna we gonna move it on. Uh, Keep it on sports. Let's go to NFL, man. I'm ready to bless the little nigga over here, man. Oh, yeah, I, I already talk about it. I, man. The NFL. Man, look, I knew this hey. shit was gonna come up anyway. When I was watching the game, I was mad. Are you, are, are you are you are you ready for this? This NFL. Yeah, fuck that shit. Hey, man, niggas for life. Fuck Pat Mahomes. Fuck Travis Kelsey. Fuck number six who picked that ball up and ran that bit back. Hey, man. Talk about it. Y'all got blessed in Germany. Nah, but ain't gonna lie though. We just saw the AFC Championship game. That, no, that, no, no. All the thing they ain't been, they ain't been Baltimore. I sit number one defense in the league. They hold the motherfucker to three points. Well, we only lost by a touchdown, and they can run the football. Oh yeah, yeah, I, yeah. You only lost by a touchdown, but you gave up twenty one. Baltimore ain't giving up shit right now. But they look like two thousand one right now, man. No, now we know what we need to do. Oh, let me let me finish real quick. Let me finish real quick. Uh, uh, uh. Tyreek Hill came to the game. Tomorrow, oh y'all gonna get this work. Yeah. That was in the prayer conference. That was in the prayer conference. Two yards. F- uh, forced from, f- I mean, fumble, and he had two drops just there. You got to show up on that now. Yeah. You said he the man. That what you said. That what they you put did. Sneed on him, bump he and is. run him all game yesterday. No, no, no. Let me finish. Let me finish. I got you. I got you. I got you. I got you. <laughs> they put Sneed on him, bumped and run, bumped. He couldn't even get off the fucking line. And when they did, he had a man over the top. You got to be that guy. That what you told me. He the man. He came in talking like that, and they lost. Now, y'all asked me last week, no, week before last when you were here, y'all talking who's going to beat them in the, in, the, in the AFC Championship. You and you. Yeah, I did. Guess what? The Chiefs beat them. The Chiefs, the Chiefs beat them. Also, Dolphins ain't beat nobody good. I told you, all five wins division gets one or zero win teams. All of them. But guess what, though? Them Bengals looking good, too, so you really in trouble. Bengals looking good. They beat, uh, what, Buffalo? Yeah. Yeah. You really in trouble. Okay. Go ahead. Go ahead. I'm got a lot of shades right now. He got okay, shades. Okay. That's Before right. you go. Go ahead. I, I, I want it all. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Hey, <laughs> let, me pick, <laughs> let me pick it back over. My man said, man, y'all went in. Man, that nigga Tyree Hill went all the way to Germany to pay $7,000 in the loot. Now how much they find him for wearing no socks? <laughs> you could have stayed your ass, you know what I'm saying, in Miami, man. Yeah, he said that now. He said, yeah. job listen, listen, I can't, I can't say nothing because I did sell on episodes before I said my picks for the Super Bowl going to be, I said it would be Philly and Miami or Philly and the Ravens. I, 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 I want to say this too. Miami is just a okay team. That's what they are. They're not, they're just an okay team. All that track team shit and all that shit, Jalen Waddle, Mostert at the fucking running back, Tyreek Hill, and and uh, uh and and, t- and two are throwing the ball, bro. Let's just be real. That's just what they are. They're not beating nobody who know how to beat them up. Period. That's like, a fact. They're just not beating nobody. They haven't beat nobody good. Bro. Go ahead though. My bad. I'm done. Okay. Now that all the haters done. Ain't yeah, no hate. That's just factual. Let's, let's get to the facts. Okay. No fact. No coaching. Facts can be hating. Coaching. Kansas City. Yes. Y'all are. Y'all have better coaching. Cause guess what? No, they you don't. Guys did. No, they don't. You guys use Travis Kelsey as a decoy the whole game. No, they don't. Yeah, they, they did. No, that they nigga was decoy like my man. No, no, you no, see, motherfucker, like, no, no play. Tra- Tra- Travis Kelsey had three catches for fourteen yards. They they made sure Mahomes didn't get shit to Travis Kelsey all game. Yeah, cause he was. I but, watched but, the game, but he was always the first option. So he basically. Th- man, no, I'm saying it went on decoy though. Every time, he, every time, every every single time they stopped the game and said every time Patrick Mahomes hiked the ball during the game, the first look that he always gave with Travis Kelsey, he was covered, bro. I swear to God. Yeah, but, his first look. They wasn't decoying him. They but, was no, Travis Kelsey. And, ass and up. No, he was a dick. But y'all have a better quarterback. Cause see, where he didn't force it to Travis Kelsey, my nigga forced it to that got down Tyreek Hill. That's when he had three niggas on him at all times too. Like the two main players was covered up the whole game. You got to show just, up, huh? You got to show up. 
You don't talk shit. You Not say, you, but you I'm say, gonna, I'm <laughs> gonna, I talk shit with that nigga. You say he's the him. Fuck? Whatever you, he said, I stand on it with him. You, you know. say he's, you say he's him. him. He is. Tyreek Hill could have been quiet. Once that game had a bad no, game. No, fuck that. Nobody you come out there, Big Ten, and roll them niggas. That's, look, man. But you didn't do that. No, we didn't. We didn't do that. Okay. But, you know, we just had to fill him out, though. Tua, I'm going to tell you. I'm, I'm, I'm going to tell Tua ass something. Like, this, this is, I need to get him a message. God damn it, it's more players on the team. Cause, and you figured it out too late in the game. That's what, the, that what it all boiled down to. Pat Mahomes is comfortable with the rest of the team getting the ball. It's not. A, I don't think Travis Kelsey say, "Hey man, I need this many catches, these many yards." Yeah, I don't Pat, think he goes to Pat and say, "He." Know MBS he, still dropping know, balls though. He know he gonna get yeah. the ball. You know what I'm saying? Pat Mahomes, I, I give everything you saying. I'm, I'm not even being funny now. Mm-hmm. I'm, being, I'm being honest. You right, but Pat Mahomes ain't got nothing else. No, I'm saying he had Scantling. They got but, but Scantling yeah, dropped. Yeah. Some, he's yeah, I was saying no, he was doing Scantling things. No, I'm not saying like he's got no, he got no, no, no prolific ass receivers. Yeah. I'm just saying. But he's that good, he can make yeah, 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 yeah. You know what I'm saying? No, yeah. I'll say like we that's a better quarterback. Okay, I got you. Like, I feel like you can put damn there, you can plug and put anybody on the Dolphins, they're gonna do pretty good. As long as you got you got weapons. But he got weapons over But there. if you are a real good quarterback, you can make a nigga to a weapon. Like Aaron Rodgers, you're used to be quarterback. You said, why you got, I ain't got nothing to do. I'm just saying, I'm doing some garbage ass niggas. But get what, though, but get what, though, hold on. No, no, since no, you, no, I ain't talking to you no, right now. I ain't talking to no. you right now. You see, my y'all just finally won the game. game. <laughs> y'all just finally won a game, yeah. but we're not well, even talking about that. What's your record? You better than y'all. What, what's the Dolphins record, though? Shit, we five like, and two, I think. Yeah, they five and two. Five and five and two. what are y'all, three and, three and five? Don't worry about what we yeah, We on the way. We finna win. Y'all the rest quarterback of the name Love Heart. Nigga, we ain't stuck here. Man, love, we got Jordan. What about the foul? <laughs> Bye. Okay. Got, you know what? Cause Tyree Hill, they're gonna go farther than D Bird. But let, we do need to get on D Bird. Now, yes, Tyree, you lost. We ain't talking no more shit. They're gonna show and prove. Yeah. Yeah. That's all I'm saying. They, they, he, he came into the game just talking to him. That's all I'm saying. He had no choice. He got this big contract. He loved him. Nigga. He got to say something. And see, I didn't even know. Are you right? I didn't even know they was playing Kansas City. And I'm like, damn, we just. No, I'm saying I didn't know until I seen it. You know, so I actually yeah. went and looked so at the schedule. Yeah. And I was like, oh, we just talked about this shit. I said, yeah. oh, yeah, this is perfect fucking time. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? But like, I, my, my, okay, so like, the main problem, let me say this, we go to the Falcon. With the Chiefs, I don't know if they're gonna win or not. I'm gonna be honest with you, they miss an Airbnb over there. They play calling this is on the office event is not the same. Two, Patrick Mahomes ain't got shit. He ain't got nothing. I don't think he got a Travis Kelsey. That's it. And him. And, and him. That's it. That's the only thing. Other than that, he running for his life trying to figure out what the fuck he don't got them to do. They ain't lost them in two games only with them. Dude. Yeah, but yeah. see, they had Airbnb. Man, the play calling was immaculate without Tyreek yeah. Hill last year. Like the yeah. motherfucker, they just won the Super Bowl, right? Yeah. 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 I ain't gonna lie, much as I hate on Patrick Mahomes, the game doesn't get them dogs. Show me why he, he made separates. Yeah, 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 he made that. He like. Bro, you know how easy it could have been for him just, just force up in the cuffs. Like, he could have did it a whole bunch of times. Like, he will cover it, but it's like, I ain't seen Patrick Mahomes throw passes that could have got to him, but he like, no. Yeah. I'm gonna turn this other nigga up, kind of down the road. I'm gonna need the other nigga to have some confidence when we start playing for real, for real. You know what I'm saying? That's a fact, true. That's so, a fact. Like, I feel like he over. Thinks the game yeah. where Tua was just thinking <laughs> in the game. Like, I want to win this game. I'm not Tyree and then right. Tua drop back and say Tyree down there somewhere. You know, you know that's like, all you can do. Like, <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Like yeah. you, you gotta use it how Tyree is you got when you hit him, you gotta hit him. Yeah. But you can't have them two drops in that fumble like that, though, bro. No, that fumble. You cannot have that. You can't have that fumble. And you can't have them two drops that he had. But that fumble for sure has a turnover. You see what I'm saying? And that nigga, so like, he picked that ball. Like, I believe he never ran in his life until then. That nigga, man, he played in that. He gone, though. If I want to throw my glasses at the TV show, I'm like, how you let this done? Oh, he got ass all of a sudden. Falcons. But yeah, man, hold up. Shout out to the real birds, the Eagles. Uh, they won me $200 the other night. You know what I'm saying? I appreciate that. I said, I said, I said the real bird. bird. And then they from Atlanta. <laughs> and I had out the real bird. You. But you know, you know, I ain't gonna even go in on the foul today. I will say nah. this. No, nah, I'll, I'll say this. this. I'll what? say this. We ain't gonna never be right <laughs> till we get a black quarterback in Atlanta. No, you know what? I will say this about the Falcons. Bro, they actually be in every game. They just can't close it out. I don't know why. I, just I don't told know you if it's why. the coach. Hennigan look the better than Ritter, though. But they be in every game. Hennigan look, Henne- Henne- look like way like better getting, than Ritter, listen, though. Listen, it ain't like they getting their ass whooped. They be in every game. They just, some kind of way at the end, man, it just, 
It's the Brady effect. Nah, somebody. <laughs> nah, we've been losing before Tom Brady. Man, I believe the Falcon sign they sold to the Illuminati, bro. Oh, so, see how much these niggas like Tom Brady, man. I'd have been sorry since before Brady was playing football. They want to, they want to give Brady the praise for that shit too. Uh-huh. There's two <laughs> niggas in this world, y'all motherfuckers get praise too for no reason. LeBron James or Tom Brady. LeBron James go out here and dunk on a nigga. LeBron was the first nigga to dunk on a, si- <laughs> a seven foot one motherfucker, yeah. bro. If Tom Brady do shit, you see Tom Brady. He got about seven this. rings. <laughs> Every time the Patriots in the Super Bowl. Nobody really wanted to see that shit, bro. The Patriots are boring as fuck. Mm-hmm. They've yeah. always been boring as fuck. Mm-hmm. Except for that one year of Randy Moss. Mm-hmm. So so is Tim Duncan, but he still, you can't take away. No, but like, basketball is, is way more fun to watch than football, though. <laughs> so what? Basketball is more fun to watch than football because it's more shit going on. Football, you're nah, I can't say nah, that. I ain't gonna Man, say that. Football, football. Basketball got more drama in the offseason yeah. than football. Football. I you know, I and, play and, basketball, and, but I ain't gonna say. So you telling me you like seeing Tom Brady three step drop back and throwing that shit to West Walker or Elderman going across the middle of the whole goddamn game? That shit what was fire. The, the year is they on. played the St. Louis <laughs> Rams, that shit was garbage. It depends on, it depend on what NBA bullshit. game is on. If it's a rival NBA game, I'm gonna watch the NBA game. Man, you ain't gonna tell me not one Patriots, <laughs> but not just a regular game. They lost. Basketball is a more active sport it's, it's, it's never stopping and keeps going you know what i'm saying football, that, i get it, it never reason, stops it, the reason why they play the replay after every play in no, football it's the reason because, why they got seven fucking games and the nfl Super Bowl got one don't nobody want to see that bullshit more than one time no you got one shot at it i get nah, it. hold on no it's no, hard no, it's no, hard no, to no, win no. a championship First, no, in the football reason, the reason than in basketball one yeah bro, you, you can't win you got one shot at this shit the bro. reason it's only one game bro nobody is built to play a series in football them hit hurts. Like, you can't have a best out of fucking seven, bro. Nah, yeah, you can't do that. Like, what the fuck? Them, them hit hurts. <laughs> like, what? what are you talking That's about? Boring. That's boring. I like to watch oh, niggas got them got to break this shit down in the film room. That, but, get, that but get what, though? But get what, though? It's it's much easier to, to score a point in, in basketball, basketball than score a touchdown in yeah. football. True. So why they give you six on when you do it? Yeah, like bro, that, that's a fact, bro. I, I tell you, go well, out there. Well, Steph Curry about to got down making a four point line. So it ain't too hard. It's just two points harder. That's all. I don't know if it's. I, I'm, I'm gonna say. I don't know if it's more funner. I'm gonna say this. Like it's more. It's more nonstop action because basketball inbound go. You know what I'm saying? Football is the reason why they show the replay after every play. But you don't nobody yeah. want to see two teams in a huddle. But you. But you said yourself though. It's you said action. niggas in basketball they don't really play hard. Like every game matters in football from college to the NFL. Yeah, I know. So it's is is more exciting because it means something. College well, the regular exciting. season basketball game may not mean that niggas just could just stay five hundred and then start turning up at a certain time before the playoffs start. No, no, no. Just because it, they care more during a play, don't mean that the game is more more active than the other game. Basketball, bro, they, they not stopping. They keep going the whole time. The ball is always dribbling. Somebody's always moving. It's the reason why we don't watch baseball to this fucking day. Because nigga, we not watching the sport when niggas got to stand in line for their turn. <laughs> yeah, them niggas do stand in line. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? We just not gonna do that. We don't watch golf. But they get a lot of money to stand in like, line. Like we don't do that, bro. Like the ball is steady moving the whole time. You yeah. know what I'm saying? Football. Like if you go to a high school game, ain't no replay. When they go to the huddle, we got to sit there and watch that shit. Yeah. Nah, I ain't, ain't no football. Just... Let me get something. I love football. I love football. But basketball better. I ain't gonna lie. I feel like basketball better. I, 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 feel, I feel like, I feel like you can get fancier. But basketball has got more swag. I don't know about that though, Scoot. I just have my opinion. Yeah, yeah, it's true. an opinion. It's but, but, not, oh, like, not, but that's the reason why we're on the podcast. Too. We debate opinions. Mm-hmm. That's why I say I don't know about that. Oh, and then my opinion about it, nigga. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Nah, nah, let me tell know. you why then. Okay, them niggas got on him. We, don't, we ain't investing in all them niggas. I don't know who on the line. I ain't investing in no nigga, period. But I'm saying, I don't, know, I don't, <laughs> I don't give a damn what they look like. No, the way yeah. I can run down a, 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 a fucking basketball team, mm-hmm. I can't run down a football team like that. You ain't supposed to because the game ain't that good. Exactly. Yeah. You, you only gonna know skill position. Who know. who getting the ball and who stopping? You can name all the players the in basketball all you want to. The sports still ain't making more money in the football. Y'all play overseas. Oh no no no. Y'all no. play everywhere. Y'all no, do no. All, all this other shit. Guess what? We play seventeen games and make t- three times the money than basketball. Far as the sport, make three times the more money than the NBA. Man, and that's yeah. Well, if you break it down like per average for games, but I don't think football niggas actually make more money. No 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 than no. no, no. You know what? The, the, the what? game of football. What's the game of football? You're saying per game. The game of football. The NFL makes more, more money. Than the NBA. Oh, okay. Y'all quit. Okay, 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 damn okay, these niggas' about, pockets. Okay. We don't care about these niggas' pockets. We talking about me and him talking about the game of basketball right, versus right, the game right, of football. Right, right. We know, it, nigga, the money could be divided by twelve people more than fifty-three. I'm pretty sure they make more money. And number twelve people on the basketball team. 
duh, it's 53 niggas on the football team. It takes more to play the game. I'm talking, about, I'm talking about what the game about the generates. Business. You talking the, the business. business. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. The business, the business yeah. of football. That's just factual. The business yeah, the of business, football yeah. makes more money. Nigga, the Super Bowl is more celebrated than New Year's, my nigga. But look, though. The Super Nobody Bowl the is the NBA biggest, is like, what, like the biggest stage in the world. In the world. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Nobody give a damn about, hey, man. Super Bowl make more money than the whole NBA season. Facts. And if you want to break it down to a nigga's do pockets, shit, we can throw in baseball. Mm-hmm. Y'all ain't making basketball, ain't, ain't making more no money than cap. baseball mm-hmm. players. That's what I'm saying. So that's why I say, like, let's not talk about the money with individuals make. Oh, I'm, I'm thinking about we just talking about players. players. I didn't know we were talking about this. NBA, the can business, go, yeah. NBA is overseas. They go play here. They go play there. They make money every fucking world. Since Michael Jordan been there, football is strictly the U.S. and they still make quadruple the money that basketball yep. makes. Brother, it's America's number one sport. Basketball, no, basketball I, just did an in tournament. Yeah, because it makes game. the most money. That's why it's America's number one sport. Y'all just, oh, not even that. They did an in America's tournament. America's pastime bro. is baseball, but not for real. I was it's most, football. Most fathers bun with their child or their sons, but you know, girls play football too now, but they bun with their child through football. It yes. makes them feel like that. Because football, football, football makes you a man. Yeah, it yeah. Make, you, you think like that. My love, but the you first sport you learn as a kid is baseball. Yeah, you pick up. Like kids yeah. pick up baseball. That, that's the first thing you do with T ball off the bat. That's the first thing. Well, you do. I think right. now, I, I think now with the generation, yeah, right. now, I, I, I think now. Baseball, well, yeah, okay, yeah. Baseball, yeah. Now, now in this generation, I'm gonna be wearing shoulder pads that's at like five. Football. Yeah, that's football now. But but when I grow up, when I was growing up, the first thing you yeah, do is T ball. It was baseball, yeah, yeah. But yeah. see, now baseball became more expensive. Mm-hmm. You ain't finna go find nine niggas with gloves, man. If you're gonna be real, you gotta, 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 hey, if you got a nigga playing baseball, hey, he on the AU team. Well, I don't know what, but it hit the goddamn, uh, hit them folk in, in uh, the rec center. Who was in the hood in the east side? But I swear to God, but he came out there with bats and gloves and everything. But we were playing, but yeah, like nigga was out there playing, no helmet on that. That was the, like that wasn't a great day in some growing up. And I, and I think football mean more than than than, than basketball. I'm gonna tell you why because football, everybody has to do their part. We done seen Michael Jordan go crazy. We done seen LeBron James drop 25 on the piston by him goddamn self. Mm-hmm. We ain't gonna see one motherfucker do shit in right. football Hold on. without everybody doing their part. That's a fact. Now, Michael Pitt did win that one game where he split those Vikings. Yeah, and guess, <laughs> and, and guess what? The wide receiver still had to run down the fucking field. The offensive line still had to block. Everything and still And the quarterback got a throw. But, all, and the quarterback but the only thing we saw in the highlight was Michael Vick just speeding. And that's cool, it. Skeet. But he still had to have the rest of the players. I got to talk shit, and though. then the coach got the call. That I right, what about Barry fucking Sanders? And what I'm saying, and, and, then, and, then, and then with that right there, like, like, Far as the game, the way its game is constructed and shit like that, it means more. Man, that last minute drive, two minutes left, got down, some, you know, this team got the ball, they got to march down the field. That shit means more, my nigga. You know what I'm saying? Then in basketball, somebody getting their ass beat by 30 or some shit like that. You know what I mean? Mm-hmm. And then I got seven tries to beat you. We playing every other day. I got seven tries. This, this one game means the world. That's it. That's it. Yeah. That's it. That's all it's going to take. Yeah, do or die. So it's March like the, the game of football is just more, you know what I'm saying? Like the immaculate reception and shit like that. But see how you name it? Everything that ain't got to do with the fucking Patriots. Because they suck. I don't want to watch them niggas in the Super Bowl. <laughs> That's what I'm boiling down to. I'm not saying I, I didn't like every Super Bowl. I'm saying I don't like to see Tom Brady and that slow-ass offense that only throws the ball five fucking yards. I don't want to see that shit. Mm. But they couldn't stop it. Right. I ain't saying they couldn't. I mean, he won his rings. I'm not saying he garbage. I, I can't, I, I, I'm saying I can't. he's not entertaining. Shit, man. Ooh, good point. Excuse I me. mean, I, I get what you're saying, but shit, and, and the man was a man out there, though. I'm not saying he, he, he didn't win. He it up. I'm not saying he ain't your goat. I'm not saying none of that shit. I'm saying he's not entertaining. Bruh, one, one, no, one, one, no, okay, if, if that's not entertaining, what the fuck was LeBron in the bubble? That was a boring as fuck. Didn't nobody even want to be there. Mm. But they counted. Well, look like Jimmy Buckets wanted to be he had a lot of emotion out there and then besides losing the finals. You know what though, I ain't, I ain't gonna lock up. I even though even though LeBron So you gonna go one finals against how many No, no, wait a minute, no, wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute. Seven. Seven. No, listen. I will he had say seven this. Seven rings that I didn't care about. No, listen, I will say this. He was lit on the Tampa Bay was lit. The two we lost this. I like. Yeah, the Tampa Bay was lit. Tampa Bay <laughs> ring was lit. Tampa Bay was lit, but I will say this. I gotta disagree with you. I think every NBA finals LeBron James been in has 
that's been entertaining. You a because damn people are looking looking oh, for no, it. Shit. Yeah. Man, that first Spurs final was goddamn four zero beat them folks by forty every game. LeBron had like t- twenty one points. That shit was not entertaining. I'm not saying how bad he played. No, no, I'm what just you just about. said was it was every guy at finals LeBron James minute was yeah. entertaining. That's, that's people looking forward to it. They still want to see was he gonna win. So why the hell was that the worst? Why, why the hell was that the worst rating? I don't think that was the worst rating. I think the the you worst said rating. Look forward no, to no, it. no, the the worst rating was when the Spurs played the fucking Detroit fucking Pistons. That shit sucked. No, no, the worst rated finals in NBA history at that time was the 2007 finals of LeBron James versus Tim Duncan. After that was the finals with LeBron James. How come LeBron James got the worst rated finals ever as far as, as, far as his, his whole totality of his career? LeBron James has the worst rating in finals history, bro. You can look it up on your phone. Yeah, I got to look that yeah, up. Yeah, look, look it up. I want you to do that. And that's my whole point. So how can you sit up and say people were looking forward to that? When Steph Curry, them a couple years ago, had had one of the highest rated fighters, other than when Michael Jordan, them had 33, 33 million people watching that shit when they played against the Utah Jazz in 1998. Oh, you don't be on Facebook. All oh, this shit be on Facebook. Me and Cup see this shit all the time. Yeah. <laughs> like, like this, shit, this shit just pops up. Yeah. You know what I mean? So, like, that's what I'm saying. Like, you can't say people was looking forward to that shit. That, who the hell want to see his team get swept and lose by 40, every 30 every game? Every game. The Spurs beat the fuck out of them folks. Like, yeah. Who the hell wanted to watch that? I think the only final, like, besides, like, the Warriors finals, what when the Lakers played, got down the Celtics and the damn Magic? Come on, Kobe? Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like, yeah. the niggas watching. Oh, yeah, I mean, yeah, I've been saying, because yeah. when, 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 when Golden State played Cleveland, that was, I think, that, that 2000, what, 2016, 2017? Man. When LeBron was on that. Right. Mm-hmm. That was the best finals right. in, a, in for a while. That was, like, like 99 to 99. Third or second left in the game. Like, that was no, 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 okay, okay, when Golden State yeah. played LeBron when he was on Cleveland. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. Now, nah, you, yeah, you right. Y'all right. I know I'm right, Greg. Now, what I said earlier, though, to that nigga Tim Duncan, boring. Cause, look, the, oh. the worst NBA Finals, every worst NBA Finals had the San Antonio Spurs playing in it. When they, in 2014, when the Spurs beat Miami with LeBron was on it. Oh, I in 1999, when the Spurs defeated the Knicks. But you know why? 1994. Huh, go ahead. You know why? Tell Duncan don't talk no shit. Yeah. He dropped your ass off, hug it, wife, and, and drop his SUV home. And then what he said about home. home in 2007 when they defeat, uh, defeated the Cavaliers, too. Like, God damn. But, but that, that's why. Tim that's Duncan. ain't got the one on here versus Detroit. Tim, Tim Duncan is just a a, a, a textbook player. He he, he ain't with all. He ain't kept down with what you talking about. He ain't talking shit. He, he playing the game going home. And the worst finals rated in NBA history, guess what? Bubble, yeah. 5.9 million, 6.6 million game two, 7.14 million game one. 2020-2020-2020. Highest rated in NBA history, 1998 Chicago Bulls, what I just damn said. 50 million motherfuckers watched it. But, I didn't know that Mike was going home. You got that one better than Mike versus the Sonics, though. 93, yeah. Michael Jordan, Chicago Bulls, the second one. But what, what the Sonics won't grade it? They ain't, they ain't showing that one. But that's what God, I'm saying, damn, bro. That shit was lit, though. You got to think, the yeah. bubble took two months off. And came back with this this like tournament. Oh shit! Then nobody, oh, then nobody want to see that shit, bro. But that's what I'm saying, like, so we, just like because we think LeBron hit rain for that year, bro. I mean, bro, I, 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 I'm I mean, saying, all I'm saying is, just because we think somebody great, don't mean that motherfucker want to see him. Then nobody watch none of LeBron's finals. Like, they didn't care. It ain't got nothing to do with him. It's just that like, a lot of a lot of these motherfuckers is born in the NBA. You know what I'm saying? Like, just because we think the game, oh shit, basketball. Then nobody want to watch that shit. Same thing like he was just saying. I ain't gonna lie to you. Tom Brady is born. He's he's motherfucking goddamn pancakes nigga at home. <laughs> what the <laughs> fuck is that? <laughs> shit, you make them, they bullshit. Go shit. take care of the Waffle House. <laughs> <laughs> you know what I'm saying? I'm just being honest. That shit, that shit is born. He ain't exciting. Patrick Mahomes is exciting. No little passes. Running around for his life and shit and throwing the ball. Uh, I'm not saying that... It, it, I'm not saying Tom Brady ain't great. I know he's the greatest quarterback of all time. I would never try to take that away from him. But yeah, it, it do be a lot of boring motherfuckers, and we we don't want to see them. To me, Floyd Mayweather boring. Yeah. Like it's a, it's a difference mm. between you great at what you do, but you just not entertaining. Not entertaining. Like I get Tim it. Duncan is the best power forward to ever play the game of basketball. True. But he's not entertaining. Mm. You're not trying to. You're not glued to the edge of your seat to watch him hit that fade away off the glass. No, you ain't. You don't really care. But you, you, you like to see KG sit there and watch. Like, Fuck. Yeah, I like honey that. nut Cheerios. He <laughs> 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 said honey nut oh, Cheerios. It is. Cabello, right. it is. Cabello, 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 yeah. Like it don't even matter. He KG ain't though. got but six <laughs> points. KG, you, you like to see that type of bullshit on the court. Yeah, you know yeah, what I mean? Yeah. <laughs> 
I, I who else got down? Got down just a boring ass player. With the him. Joker, name, huh? The Joker. The Joker. Yeah, he boring. He too. boring as hell. You know what? The you know what the Joker is? He's that white dude at the wreck that you just like. How the fuck is this yeah. nigga killing us? The Joker is plain oatmeal. Facts. <laughs> Basics. No, no, well, no, no, I ain't gonna lie now. Mm-hmm. One time, the Joker was entertaining in that Lakers series because he was giving that nigga AD buckets, boy. Yeah. Now, that one series, that cracker was entertaining, boy. That white, that, 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 that uh, one foot pull man, up, three, three point. Five. That, that <laughs> shit was so arced up, man. That nigga had some form. Why that nigga arm like this? <laughs> that shit went, and then it was drawn. Yeah. I said, God. Dang. Yeah, yeah, that shit does crazy. But yeah, man, I feel you though. Know, it's it's sports is delicate, man. Cause we worried about entertainment, right? Cause that's what. They I, do and I think LeBron entertain. I'm gonna be honest, but I just think people d- don't like LeBron, so they don't watch it. Yeah, I'm just gonna be honest with you. They LeBron probably, got you know, no. And, and that's the only reason that made me think that people want to watch. Cause it, 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 when you watching him, either you want him to lose or you want him to win. I don't, Ain't no in between. With I just think they put too much. You hate him. No, no, they put too much. Just like, just like you said, Floyd Mayweather. I think people will watch Floyd, bought them pay per view because it's, it's it, he gave he make made you choose. Like either you want to see him finally lose. Or for the people who really like them, they like, oh man, we watching a, a master class yeah, boxer today. I'm gonna tell you what, what, what fucked me up, LeBron. Yeah. They were miscategorizing him too fucking much. Like, you want him to be MJ, but this nigga's just gonna pass the ball. That's why Kobe told like, what the fuck are you doing? Nigga was trying to make Ultimate you that nigga. Game. Yeah, like, ever since mm-hmm. then, LeBron would not shoot that bitch, bro. Like, so he could never be that nigga until he shoot that bitch. He's a nigga. <laughs> He's one of the niggas. He's one of the ones. But he's not the nigga. He gonna pat that bitch double double. <laughs> <laughs> what the fuck happened to him? He said double double. But yeah, speaking of uh, NBA, NBA young boy on house arrest for two years. Seven hundred and twenty days. No, two years and going. Yeah, he's still on that bit. That yeah. shit time served, man. Yeah, I'm cooked. I'm hey man, you cook hey man, I don't, I don't get that shit. I told I, when I started, I said I ain't bashing your boy today, man. That shit right there is fucked up. I don't know if y'all. Uh, have ever did any type of time or in your life, but but it, it don't matter how big your house is. Right. If I tell you you can't leave that bitch, and it's been two years, man, it don't matter what kind of square feet you got, man. You going crazy in there, man. Mm-hmm. It don't matter what type of uh, extra shit you got in your house. Even if you got a pool in that motherfucker, you done swam six hundred and thirty two laps around <laughs> that motherfucker. Like right, it, right, it, right, you right, know right. this. This nigga is doing shit now that let me just do. This this nigga rented a horse yeah. <laughs> and, and put in his backyard. Yeah. Like, bro, he, he's just thinking of, of then you think got all these children. He can't leave with them. He 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 just trying to find any type of way to entertain these kids. Well, yeah. At least he ain't locked up and he can still get some pussy though. I mean, but bro. He can eat it's, good it's, too. It's, he, it's, he can eat good too. That man ain't took his girl out on a date in two years. Okay, let me ask you this. We're gonna cry about you being locked up at your mansion? Or you wanna go be locked up in Thug Mansion? That's what I'm saying. <laughs> man, I don't wanna hear that shit. Hey, look, I look, 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 look. This may don't, be Don't listen. tell me about a nigga listen, that free that can smoke <laughs> Zaza all day and have unprotected sex. But I can. He can't still can't, he can't still, smoke. He still got a report. But can he can he have unprotected sex all day? What nigga fucking in nigga fucking in the county? And then what do you want to? No, 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 what you want to? But he can fuck in the temperature up high, temperature down low. It doesn't matter. We're not man. Hey, hey, listen, balls man you know, two man. years though, bro. Hey, but listen, that, hey, that in may, county, that it, may be a good thing for somebody his age. I understand. You know, at least he ain't understand. blowing money right. He ain't blowing his money. Man, he ain't got nowhere to go to blow it. Hey, man. man, come on, man. It's only so much shit you can order. Hey man, <laughs> that shit time. Hey man, I'm just being real. If you, bro, two years, bro. If you go on a court for two years, you ready to get this shit over with? Yeah, you right. So hey, come on with yeah, it. What, what, you what, 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 you what we doing? What we doing though? Would you rather be on the yard or in the mansion? Man, give me my time. What are y'all talking about? Give me my time. Give me a verdict. I don't want to be on nothing for two. I do not want to be incarcerated, whether I'm at home or in jail for two years. Oh, shit. Go on and give me something, man. Let, let's do it. You tripping, Flint. Then let them come back and say, shit, we got you a 10 do too. Oh, I done did too. Mm. So you straight now. No, I ain't. I, they they going to want you to go do two more. 
No, no, if they come out ten, you do. He ain't two, that ain't time. No, you don't get no, you don't get no credit for doing for being on house arrest for two years. That is not that is not equivalent to credit. Well, you still got to go do two. Well, let's just be fair. Well, how, how long he's, he's been not in going back? Two to years and counting. And how many more he got to be on until they get ready for to take him to trial? So he does not know. Yeah, he's waiting to go. For, to like, go no, back that's back. what I'm saying. So he's on bond, parole. No, he's on he house broke. arrest. He's on house arrest. So he's Until, out on the bun. Yes, because he's they, out on he, bun. He's a flight. Okay, risk. guess what? That's what happens when you're out on bun. Cups, you got to sit your ass down until they tell you to come to trial. I'm going to have that shit, bro. This nigga rich. Hey, now, uh, if, if it was a regular nigga that got to go so, back to the projects and ask niggas to borrow money and ask motherfuckers to go do shit, no, he's paying everybody the fuck around him. Man, still, man. Hey, man. Shout out to uh, Sharon the Gardner. No NBA young boy slander will be tolerated on this podcast. <laughs> what are you slandering, <laughs> cuz? That nigga I, I, rich. Yeah. I can't say shit about hey, a nigga. Uh, what the fuck is hey, free young boy. Yeah, free. Um, he free YB. Look, he in that, he in that you match. You know what I'm saying? Should nobody have to be sitting on house arrest for two years? But that's a long fucking I don't care time, what they bro. talking about. Nobody should be on house arrest for two years. I don't care a damn who it is. All right, well, well, guess what they're telling you, Mr. Ron? They want you to, they want your son to go on back sit in there. You know what? He, if I'm him, I ain't mad. I'm sending my ass out, out here until that he, trial he, fucking happened. No, he beat the charge. Oh, so, so let so, him off of house arrest. His his team done filed the motion saying that his mental health is messed up. Well, he see, should he not have to. He's like that's what I'm saying. Trial and all this bullshit. See, now you tell now, me. I, I think it's for another charge. charge. It's, a, yeah, it's another charge on, he's waiting on now. Yeah, he beat the feds. Let him off a house arrest. Nobody should be on house arrest for two years. But uh, I don't, it don't matter how big your house is. It don't matter how much money you got. You should not, bro, sitting in your house for two years, bro. It don't matter if you in a mansion, man. That shit do not matter. I, after two years, bro, you done did everything you can do. I ain't saying this right, but niggas sitting in their house for about a damn near a year and a half during the pandemic. Man, y'all had everybody and their mom over. They man can't have none of his friends. <laughs> they man can't have none of his friends over. Can't none of his people. Hey, hey that man in Utah. Yeah. Oh, his, yeah. his homeboys yeah. can't come through. Yeah. That man got to get niggas to pull up, signed off by a judge. Hey, man, we in Atlanta, man. Ain't none of y'all niggas signing y'all house for no whole year during the pandemic. I right, you're right. We didn't we, have no we, 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 we was outside no after a Atlanta. day. Yeah, we ain't had no pen. Hey, that man, no that man, that man, that man got to wait. Well, let me pull up on you, but hold on, boy. I gotta get got down the judge to sign you off, boy. Yeah. yeah. But look, them folks for say you were shoplifting last year, boy. You cannot come over. So what? What his new charge supposed to be? I don't, I don't know the details of his new charge, though. but he, that way he ain't on now. How can you get a new charge when you? When you've been well, it's not up? a new. It's a, it's another charge that he already oh. had. Yeah, I, I get what you're saying. But I gotta be biased. I'm sorry. You know what I'm saying? I can't. I just, I just don't think no difficult. It don't matter if you're rich, man. He can't spend it. Why he can't? That man getting fresh as fuck every day to, to walk around his house. He There's a lot of niggas we know that do that shit. <laughs> the niggas ain't fresh as fuck. What the fuck is you talking about? And we'll take a picture. I ain't finna do a damn thing. <laughs> Man. Don't do that, cup. No. <laughs> we know millions of niggas that do that shit. They get fresh as fuck. Fresh as a song, bitch. They just sit in the house. Nowhere. <laughs> but they, they have, have the option. They, 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 they have the option ski. to go somewhere. Hold on, Ski. They at least walk to the, look, they at least walk to the store. Man, them motherfuckers ain't going. No, they ain't got no money. They bought the option. <laughs> Don't tell me about goddamn that man got all the sauce in his closet and these niggas don't buy one sauce. What sauce? They finna wear that shit right there and take a thousand pictures. He and might go, take he might take one of his back. You don't even know what the front of the fit look like, nigga. This hey man, crazy. this man got that. Don't you tell me about these niggas around here ain't got man, hey don't man, tell me about nobody. Jekka, Jekka, he rich don't mean it's okay. It's yeah, it's, it's yeah. extra okay. It, no, it's not, bro. Hey no, man, it's not, uh, man. Free free YB. Free, hey man, get that man up out of there, man. Y'all like we don't know niggas. Man, it's a nigga right now. <laughs> putting on the freshest fit ever. And it's his homeboys. But he better put that shit on and go in the inbox. Hey, I do it every <laughs> week. He ain't going nowhere but in somebody's inbox. That's all he going. That's all he doing. Going to somebody's somebody inbox. And his homeboy, shit, and you know what his homeboy said? Hey, man, take my shit back. Don't, don't, don't leave out here with my but shit yeah, on. Uh, free <laughs> nigga said don't leave out here with my shit on. But free, yeah. free YB, man. But let's, let, let's, yeah, let's free, move on. Uh, oh, man. This has been hitting the airwaves for about the last week. Saucy. Santana, Santana, Santana. Oh, man. Academics yeah, feud. Oh. 
Uh, yeah, I'm straight. I'm straight. I want to know what y'all hit the boy drinking bar. I want I want to know what y'all take on this. Uh, hey man, let, let me break that, boy, that boy saw say, hey man, it don't, it don't matter what you say. Let, he, let, at the end of the day, he's still a man. He's still a beat your ass. Let me let me say this real quick. I think this started from academics giving his opinion on the young the city girls album right. or something like that. Y'all niggas in the comment who get mad at us because we don't know all this shit. We don't give a damn about this shit, man. We just do this shit because this was going on in the culture. Right. But as far as I know, the city, academic gave the pen on city girls. I'm saying it's over with for them. They're only doing six or eight thousand. Academic said the label ain't gonna let that happen because they're gonna buy a couple copies because they're on a major label mm -hmm. and they're not gonna let that number stand. Ended up, I think he was pretty right. I think they ended up the number coming back being like 11K total, 10K or something like that. So the label ended up buying like three. Maybe more than that. Maybe it could be 5,000 copies for him. Anyway, with that being said, Sauce Santana felt the way about him dip dogging him to this and that, all this other shit. Y'all want me to kick this off? Or? Yeah, go ahead. Right. Think? Yep. I feel like this. But hold on, hold on, before you start. Before you go, start, go ahead, you start. Before you start. Let, 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 let them know what Buddy said. Oh, he going to, um. Look at him, Because y'all dead ass wrong, man. We, we, we. Man. Oh, yeah, Kai. Because look, look, hold on, hold on. Hold on, hold on. Hold on. <laughs> Tell him what he said. He said he gone. Hold on. <laughs> it's a grown ass man. It's a grown ass now. man. Now. Talking to another, another grown, grown ass, ass man. man. And what he said. One of them got fingernail cut. And what he <laughs> said. What he said. The bro. nigga with the fingernail said he gone. He gone. Put them paws on DJ Academic. Then he gonna put that that dick on that nigga. Pause. And pause. At, pause. pause. <laughs> and I don't mean the Glock. And yeah, he talking about real wood. He talking about real pause. wood. Pause again. Now. I'm getting tired of motherfuckers saying what I can come on here and say about that community. Hey, man. Oh, no, 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 no. I'm going to get him caught. I'm going to get him. Wait, 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 wait. I get tired of, like, you be one of the main ones. Well, Skeet, you can't go in there talking about that community like that. Now, what the fuck did that community get off going at the community? Exactly, man. man. They got, they, they got they all wrong. They got all wrong. That's real, man. That's a real, man. That's a real, man. That's a real, man. Oh, Saucy. I'm pretty sure Sauce Walker can't stand that nigga named Saucy Santana. Like you still in the drip for one that, and two. If we call him what I really want to call him, you know, we got them what? bombs. The oh, bombs, yeah. We gonna oh we gonna get flagged. We gonna get yeah, oh, man. But he can he gonna say he can, he can rape a straight man. Yeah. But all, all right I want to say is though, all I want to say there though, how the fast. fuck the DJ Academic supposed to defend himself on that? Because mm. if he calls it, 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 if, if he, he, if he, he get counsel, if he get counsel if he replies. No, but it's okay for this man. Guess it's what? It's a hate crime. It's right. not fair. No, this man get on his platform talking about he gonna drop wood on what academics. You need to. I don't know. You ain't about it. You need to get that Glock and say try. And then, you know what? I don't know something. Try. Too. Yeah. Whenever a straight man defends himself yeah. against a, you know, all the letters, yeah. you will get. To, they'll tell you you're not comfortable. In your sexuality. Yeah, Maybe y'all ain't comfortable in y'all sexuality, but y'all gotta attack yep. straight people. Yep. Ooh. That's a fact. Look, it's laws saying we can't say shit to y'all, but y'all can say whatever y'all want to us. Exactly. Get, we, we he can't defend this. Yeah. Guess what, though? It, it ain't two, nothing he can say. It's two things that happens when you argue with a person in that, that them alphabets. Yeah. Mm -hmm. You can't win. A straight man cannot win, because guess what? You weird as fuck for arguing with somebody that's gay. True. And then you're not going to beat them in a tongue wrestle. Yeah, I, um, I agree. Now, you y'all right. I ain't, I was going to go that way anyway. But what I say, like when me and you, when we talk about on this podcast, what I'm telling you is to keep us from getting in trouble because we're trying to get there. Yeah, okay. The, hey, man, y'all don't understand. You it's a lot saying? of shit that I really, like, God works in a mysterious way. I probably been here last week. Dwight Howard, you got saved, cuz. <laughs> I want you Dwight, to know, cuz. You got saved, cuz. You got saved. <laughs> that's that's not real stuff going on Dwight. in my life, too. Yeah. I don't, we don't need no letters from his team. <laughs> but we, 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 we said what we cool. said last week. But B12, week, boy, he had a problem on it. But if I done pushed up in here, boy. <laughs> <laughs> Big old ass nigga. Oh, man, you know what I'm saying, boy. But well, I'll say this, bro, like. Motherfucker gotta pick a side, bro. Like, yeah. like women, women, gay community, or something. That gotta pick a side. Cause either we gonna be equal or we ain't. Right. Fact. I have no problem with with not saying nothing to y'all or whatever it is, and we get in trouble. But y'all can say whatever, get and not get these jokes or whatever. You know what right. I'm saying? Academic literally said the city girls album flop. Y'all get upset. Thomas, so he shouldn't be talking about women like that. The album was trash. It was trash. Oh, the album didn't. I ain't gonna say it was trash. I, I haven't heard of them. I'm saying that, but the album only sold did this and that. It only sold did this and that. Mm -hmm. 
when Dirk underperformed, Dirk got these jokes. When young, when Lil Baby album one got down he as good as it baby. was, <laughs> he called him Lil Baby. He got them jokes. When yep. goddamn NBA Youngboy didn't do numbers, they fell out behind that shit. Yep. He got them jokes. But because they women, we're not supposed to say nothing about their album sales and shit like that. I'm going to say something. A couple weeks back, we actually did a segment on the City Girls, and I cut the whole part out because of the shit with academics and Saucer Turner. You remember I told yeah, you about I remember, that? Yeah. Should have kept that shit in there. You should have kept that shit be- in there. Because... At the end of the day, if if it's gonna be equal all the way across the board, we should be able to sit up here and say, all oh, these motherfuckers getting mad at him tomorrow, so he shouldn't be going to win like that. Cause what they album didn't sell shit. Y'all should have bought it. Y'all should have went and bought the shit. If a motherfucker, if, 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 if and far as the gay community did this and that and all this other shit, so at the same time, you gotta get these jokes. Plain and simple. Yeah. Like, you gotta get these jokes from and, whichever way they're coming from. And then y'all know I know what pissing me off the most. What? He, he ain't even got shit to do. They ain't even put you on the album. Right. A nigga sit up and say, man, yeah, I don't like that girl eyelashes. You can't be bashing women. What is wrong with you and all this other shit? Man, that shit is Niggas crazy, get bashed bro. all day. We, we broke. We we dead beats. We we yep. some of everything. Yep. But you get the talk. Oh, the biggest one, but don't don't be coming up short. Oh, oh yeah. Shit. Oh yeah. You in the group chat. <laughs> you in the girl group chat. But when did it ever become cool to just let that shit just rock what they got going on though. Like, for real. Like, like that thing about that. That shit was not, that shit ain't never supposed to make him. Like, academic can't be if academic beat him up, he's supposed to beat him up. Mm-hmm. If academics lose to him, he got beat up by, by yeah. you know what I'm saying? Like what I'm saying, can't But win. even if by him uh, initiating putting his hands on him, it's a hate crime. He wrong. He wrong. But this man literally told him he gonna sodomize him after and nobody says shit. Physically harming him. Nobody says there's that. nobody because of his opinion. But guess on, what? On the These straight men are sticking up for you, cuz. Hey, yeah, man. Look here, man. Cuz I don't hey man, I got shot by a homosexual gang member. <laughs> so I know how it feels to get hit with that hate crime. <laughs> he got hit with a hate crime. Cause. I got hit with a hate crime. I ain't even know they let them got no, I ain't even know they let that type of shit in now. <laughs> you know got shot by a homosexual. A homosexual gang member. <laughs> <laughs> Allegedly. 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 Nah, he, he put my name in his paperwork, so nah, that nigga shot me. <laughs> I don't care. I don't, don't got to. One Allegedly. thing about me, bro, I ain't got to hold up no nothing for nobody, because I know who I am, and that nigga ain't going to push up. That It only happened once. You see, I keep, you see, no, it's on me, but play. The belt will come off. I probably got it. The belt will come off. You all got it to come off. Now, see, I didn't have the belt that day. Had a belt. I ain't had the belt that day. So, you know what I'm saying? Everybody get caught loafing or lacking. You know the new yeah. slang out here. Yeah. But I, I promise you that belt will come off to that ass. Yeah. <laughs> like, yeah, but I got it. But shit hey, happens. Man. Yeah. I, I think, I just think Sauce Santana owe that man DJ Academics an apology, man. Yeah. Straight up. No, the whole up. the whole alphabet community. Yeah. Owes see, him an see, city girl, y'all didn't do the right thing. Y'all didn't say it, y'all didn't say it. But he it didn't, he didn't make it personal. You just talking about their music. But that, and that's what I'm it. saying. Yeah. But in my, in my question, the thing is, not my go question. Solo. He okay. said what? He told JT to go solo. He was like, JT need to go solo. He said, because Carisha, she, 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 she like run she's up behind it. She don't care about the music. You know what I'm saying? But, yeah, but, I mean, but, but them are facts. Right? JT right back. Good. Yeah. But them are facts. He didn't say nothing personal. No. He, he, it's it's a fact. He's critiquing. But for, but them, for, for everybody to get on line and, and, and act like what, what Sauce, Saucy Santana said is cool and funny, y'all dead ass wrong. Yeah. Yeah. Y'all dead ass wrong because if that man get up there and start dropping them F bombs and calling that man out his name, he counseled. Y'all called that man the the F word that rhymed with mag. Two Saucy Santana did two times. Carisha wrote it out or some shit like that. They yeah. called academic that? Yeah, she yeah, Saucy Santana said. So why we can't say that then? No, no, not with the O T on it. Just oh. that, just the just the a G. Yeah. You know that ain't no better. It ain't no better. But I'm saying, yeah. and nobody batted an eye. You know what I'm saying? Nobody said mm-hmm. nothing. And then on top of that, like, look, just because all y'all, everybody out there who's in that community, if, if you get to argue with somebody straight, quit using the fact that, oh, he must be gay as an insult to somebody, to, to a straight person or some yeah. shit like that. So if that's the case, you're going to get these 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 maggots all day. Facts. You're going to get all of this shit. You know what I'm saying? Because... That's y'all only come back to somebody that you get into it with who's straight. Like, like, like it's okay for y'all to sit up and call us all this shit. You know what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. All these, 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 these uh slurs and shit like that. But as soon as one of us say that shit, oh, cancel his ass, get his ass up out of here. Oh, and I'm ready for Cancel culture ain't real. I I, I yeah. agree with Kanye West. That shit ain't real. And I'm ready for somebody say, oh, Skeet J don't like gay folks. No, I got plenty of gay family members. And I got no, 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 no. two no, of my no, best no, no, friends no, no, no. are gay that watch. No, no, that no, watch no, the no, 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 don't even do that. Cause they say that that's a way.
play or somebody trying to act like, oh, I got gay family. Yeah. Fuck that. Leave your shit where it's at. Yeah, man. yeah. Oh, but yeah. I feel like they know, that, know. That, that's equivalent yeah. to a white person. Like, oh, they got black, black friends. friends. Oh, oh yeah. okay. But, but I did that. get shot by a gay gang member. But <laughs> who was liking transmission pictures on um <laughs> the fucking Instagram stuff. Yeah, we're gonna put it out there. <laughs> nigga know. Yeah, they can act like they don't, but they know. <laughs> Let go, man. What do we got, G man? Shout out you, Academic. We got your back, cuz. I'm saying, yeah, DJ Academic, keep your head up, man. I'm gonna come back to one, but since we on music, let me, let, let's just stick on music for a minute. Mariah Carey is being sued for 20 million for her Christmas song. Mm. How? What song? Talking about did, did, that, uh, the. It better not this be Christmas oh, This Christmas. Oh, the one that be on all the commercials. Yeah, the one she got to oh, get, oh, get paid like 2 million every year off of. Who the fuck sell her for that? Who's that they gotta be dead that came back to life because she's been know. doing that. Man, song. you know that's a, new, that's a new way, man. Sue and say you had a song before or some shit like that, man. man. That's what that's about. Hmm? I'm, I'm, I'm asking, like, what? That's, that's what they're trying about. to say that basically that they got had a song that came out before Mariah Carey or some okay. shit or wrote a song that came out before her shit. And that she stole it from them type of shit, or has similarities to their song. Wait, like not? Well, she came up with that like nineties, yeah, nine. Exactly. They don't like. They don't like that a black woman is getting residual Hold every on. It, every year it's, off it's, of it's Mariah uh, Carey Black Christmas songs, huh? Mariah Carey Black. Hell to our community, she is. Well, I mean, yeah, I mean, she, I mean, I mean, she mixed, but yeah, she ain't white. Oh, I, mean, I don't know. Well, is she black? Yeah, to me, she's no, like, she's like the Ray Sherman song, if you ask me. She's just like, she's no type. She's like, <laughs> bad bitch. She's just a bad bitch. You know, so it's, a, it's a certain race called Ma 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 Listen, Mariah is a sister. She's, she's, a, she's, she's Irish, Afri African American, and Afro Venezuelan. So, yeah. okay, so what? She's, she's a, Irish, African American, she's and, and, and Afro Venezuelan. So, yeah, she, she just you ain't white, she's you a bad bitch. If you ain't white, you're black, cup. That's it. She black. That's a she whole like, lot of white shit. Like the Starbucks. <laughs> I, Irish, Venezuela. Okay, okay. But, she said uh, she's like Starbucks. Yeah, like, you know, the, the vanilla mocha coffee. Okay. Yeah. I mean, I, I ain't got no problem. She fine. I give her that. You know, anyway, like, Mariah, like keep doing your thing. Keep making this money. They gonna sue. They gonna sue Mariah, man. Mariah. Nick Cannon got her back, man. He hey, man. Yeah, yeah that's crazy. Man. Mariah been popping since glitter. Yeah, man. Y'all fuck quick. How is she gonna sue Mariah Carey this late in her career? Like, nigga, she ain't even dropping new shit because she don't care. Nigga, like, like she, she enjoying life. Life. Like, y'all late as hell on that. They just wait till it ran up a certain amount of numbers. <laughs> and said, yeah, we're gonna get there. Yeah. But moving on, um, this would be a good one, man. Is Prime Shaquille O'Neal the greatest center of all time? I want y'all to. Think about everybody as a center in their prime. Yes. I think I think Prime Shaq was the complete package, man. Scoring, defense, rim protector. Uh, I mean, I, I can't just – because, you know, I can name some great big men that were some good defenders, but they weren't dropping 30 like Shaq were doing the same thing. Then I can name some offensively good big, but they weren't they, – you, you weren't finna drop 30 on him. You know what I'm saying? Like – so I, I, I only think one player it, 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 I compare to him. The I seen play. It, yeah, yeah. I, 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 I got I, I gotta put emphasis I, I on to say I seen it, yeah. play. It was some niggas that put up them the crazy numbers, the but who, other than Hakeem, who I actually who I actually seen, yeah, I probably have to agree and say Shaq because I seen like I didn't see Wilt Chamberlain put up fifty points and thirty rebounds. I mean, they say he did it. I didn't see it, but um, I mean, it's niggas that got numbers like that. But I mean, what I personally seen, I probably have to go with Shaq. Nobody is seeing Prime Shaquille O'Neal. Good fuck, you gonna get Hakeem in his prime, Wilt in his prime, Bill Russell will get his ass punished. <laughs> and then Bill Walton, anybody with Bill in their name getting beat the fuck up. I don't give a damn who it is. Any, I ain't never met What about Wilt? Anybody, we, like I just said, first person, Wilt Chamberlain, Prime Shaquille O'Neal will punish anybody. I don't give a fuck who it is. I'm not talking about Prime, I'm talking about them first three rings with the Lakers. Nobody's seeing that nigga. Shaquille O'Neal literally made the game change. We took, we said a couple weeks ago we were talking about Adam Iverson and all the other niggas. Mm -hmm. Oh, they changed the game. No fuck they did. Shaq literally changed the game. Shaq made the league change equipment, nigga. <laughs> <laughs> Hey, yeah, but they had to get true. reinforced. They had to get re they, nigga. They brought in reinforced breakaway rims, nigga, for Shaq. Hey, nigga. man, that shit used to be fighting the rims. Yo team, yeah, your yeah. team, <laughs> your team. It's it's niggas that played back then that literally had a career because of Shaquille O'Neal. What I mean is, your team had to have three bigs on it just for fouls. Every That's NBA yeah. team had three bigs, no matter what. 
Every single NBA team. Nigga, nigga, nigga motherfucking Cooper Will Purdue Bulls. was not supposed to be in the NBA. Facts. These niggas weren't supposed to have a spot. Nigga. Bill Winnington Antonio either. Davis. Antonio Davis. Antonio Davis. All these niggas, bro. Bill Winnington. Shaq made you, bro. Shaq. Shaq. <laughs> man, come Coach. on, man. I mean, this, this, Longley and all the Man, I'm telling Purdue. you. They, they brought in three in the key because of Shaquille. Nigga, they got rid of the zone because of Shaquille. I mean, they, they brought in the, the zone, zone because of Shaquille O'Neal. This is what Shaq did. I ain't talking about... Fuck AI, and I don't mean that shit no disrespect way. Fuck AI, fuck LeBron, fuck Mike Alderman. Shaq literally changed the way the whole game And when played. you think about that, that literally. might have that stopped him from getting more rings by letting them bring in. All that so, shit. That's what you said. I'm so good. Can't nobody guard me one-on-one. Nobody, bro. Nobody. You I'm can't good. officiate me because I'm nigga. always going to be fouled because niggas can't stop what I'm doing. Y'all can say whatever y'all want to. Facts. Y'all can say whatever y'all want to about them high, them numbers, them, them crazy numbers Wood Chamberlain had. Nigga, I got two eyes, nigga. I seen that black and white footage. He ain't seeing Shaquille O'Neal in this prime. Shaq will punish that skin that nigga. I'm just being honest, bro. Like, yeah. them, them little finger rolls at the rim over them, them weak ass white boys. Man, gonna send that shit all the way to Highland, bro. Shit, he gonna send that shit across the fucking. Man, what? That nigga gonna send that shit from California to Highland. Man, man stop this shit, bro. Go watch Shaq them three years with the Lakers, man. Ain't nobody. No. Hakeem, nobody. All they need to see is one play. The spin, the back down, spin, spin move, move, dunk on Jerry, Jerry Dudley. Dudley. Oh. And we do like this. <laughs> little bit ass boy. Man, man. Dudley got over that crooked ass nose and threw that ball and he said, man. you motherfucker. <laughs> <laughs> you motherfucker. <laughs> hey, what? <are> they? <laughs> Nobody, bro. I don't care who you go. That nigga literally. You find me a rule that changed because of another player. Other than Shaquille on there. Maybe what? Some, some, some shit with a three or some shit. Because Steph Curry some shit like that. Right up. Other than that, Shaquille O'Neal yeah, changed the way. Step, step the clerk. Closest one, as far as like just literally changing the game. Like he got well, he changed the way the game was played. Well, Shaq yeah, 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 changed the, the actual rules, rules of yeah. the fucking what about game. Mike, Mike, Mike changed the rules. Too, yeah, with well, well, Mike hand checking. Yeah, hand yeah. checking. Yeah, with the, I, I give Mike that. You know what I'm saying? Well, I ain't gonna say that was Mike though. I thought that was the lead. They the been lead. playing. The lead, the lead, the lead Mike just came into it. Was into a guard. The lead, the lead wanted more point score. Yeah. So it wasn't a hand checking with Mike though. It was more. But Shaq, you couldn't guard. Shaq changed the nigga. They changed the equipment because this nigga man. Boy, I swear to God, Shaq was. But what would right. happen? Y'all need, okay, now y'all understand I'm, I'm a little younger than y'all guys. Right, right. Yeah. So, mm-hmm. so, so when Shaq dunk and the whole fucking backboard shatters. Mm-hmm. Or the goal just falls completely yeah. down. Yeah. So is the game over? It, no, it's, no, they probably going to pause that whole thing. another one. Mm-hmm. going to pause that whole for TV, a while, bro. TV break. Mm-hmm. They got to bring out a whole nother rim. A yeah. whole da, da, nother da, goal da, da, or... Da, 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 they gonna break out a whole nother Hey, nother man. Goal. I used to always yeah. think, man, if I dunk that motherfucker, man, the God and the I won. Mm-hmm. Well, yeah. If should. I dunk that bitch and the rim shatters and they got you got to do all of that, I won. Yeah, man. I will tell you, man. Imagine they never brought in a zone, bro. Man, they, man, the Lakers would have won five. Man, or they never brought in the three and the key and all that shit. What you mean by brought in the zone? Seriously, the NBA back in the day, you had to play man defense. Mm-hmm. There wasn't no, wasn't no zone. Zone, nah, you know what I'm saying? Nah, so you like, play. So, yeah, you got to play straight up man defense. You got to play. You had to be a man. When Shaq came in, they brought in zone defense and shit because mm-hmm. he can't nobody stop him. And then they brought in three in the key where couldn't nobody just sit up under the goal all day. And when you start making it where fouls counted for real, yeah. now the stretch four and all that yeah. started coming about. So now all those big niggas that like Charles Oakland that were big in the league and ain't had no game, nah, you can't get your goofy ass That's out there. I'm telling you, man. See, Kendrick Perkins got his ass on pretty quick. And, and Shaq was so, per- yeah, facts. And Shaq was so dominant that your team had to have three bigs just for fouls. You, you had like, to. If you was didn't, like, they were like getting punished. You know what I'm saying? So niggas play. So it was a couple of niggas in the league, maybe like ten, what two times? What do you mean? I mean thirty teams. It was sixty niggas in the league that were the ones supposed to be in the league. They were just big and tall, and he could, they could file Shaq six times a game, just just straight up. You know what I'm saying? So that's what I'm saying. Like Shaq literally changed the way your team had to reconstruct this fucking roster. Because you know they were going to the finals. Yeah, you knew that shit, bro. He was that good, man. They wasn't doing that for Hakeem. Man, they imagine, wasn't doing that for Pat. They wasn't doing that for none of them. This shot worked out like, oh my God, I can't believe I'm about to say this. Like Dwight Howard. Mm. Dwight. Imagine what Shaq would have been. Because he already was that nigga. Four rings. He might have left four or more on the table. Yeah. Shaq yeah. would have been here if he would just worked out. He just didn't work out. Man, man, Kobe man, up. They definitely Phil told him, rings. you go win MVP. And Kobe, you become my best player. Yeah. Yeah. Well, we got G, man. Let, let's let's stay on basketball for it. This this is gonna be a good one. Uh NBA players who didn't see their full potential. Mm. I got mm. five names in my head already. I can go T Mac. Fucking Grant Hill. 
goddamn uh, Derrick Rose. Derrick Rose. Thank you. Yeah. Like uh, 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 who didn't see that full potential? Penny Hardaway. Uh, T Mac. I'm gonna say I got T Mac <laughs> off top. Um, who didn't see their full potential? I'm gonna say Brandon Roy. Brandon Roy. Oh, that's a good one. Oh, that's yeah. a good one. Too. That was a sniper. That man. was a good one. Too. Like he was Dame Litter before Dame. Kobe, 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 Kobe said that's the most. That's the that's the shooting guard that he had the most trouble with. What about Rudy? What name? Rudy. Uh, no, you ain't talking about no Rudy Gobert. No, what? hell no. You ain't talking about no Rudy Fernandez or no, Rudy Gay. I can't nah, think of Ain't nothing Rudy Rudy in the NBA. <laughs> they really stay full of potential. All the Rudys, they ain't talking about Rudy. Uh, uh, I think I was talking about Rudy Gay, though. Man. Stop it. Miss Please. Now, <laughs> now, Brandon Bray. What about Brandon Jennings? He played enough. No, he, yeah, he, he, yeah, he, nah, he, he went on. He wasn't gonna be no more than what he is. But Brandon, Brandon, Brandon like just go. when you go home tonight before you watch one. No, I, I, I know. Watch hey. Brandon Bray. Ain't nothing coming to my head right oh, now. My, 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 my definitely top three would be Penny Hardaway, Grant Hill, and Derrick Rose. Yeah, don't I really believe if none of them niggas got injured, like oh my god, yeah. bro. Sky's my top, my top Sky's is T Mac. Trace McGrady was true. Yeah, yeah. I ain't, I ain't definitely. Uh, Greg Oden. We, we saw LeBron before we saw LeBron with Grant Hill, I feel like. Greg, yeah, Grant Hill. Greg you said Oden? Greg Oden? Greg Oden. You think he mm. would have just been that, that guy? The way I'm saying, even before he got injured, just the way he played, you think he would have been Yeah, but him and Bernard Roy would have been on the same team. He never, team, he never, so he never so. was healthy. Yeah, he, he, he yeah, came true, in the league. That's true, that's true. He came in the league hurt. He didn't and then Bernard Roy was pretty much hurt the whole time. Man, think about it. They could have had Brandon Roy. That was the Bucks one. No, that was um, Portland. Portland, Portland yeah, yeah, yeah. Like that's that's when you watch Portland Trail. Like Lamarcus Aldridge was like playing like a poor man's Tim Duncan out there. Like that shit was like all, all right watching them nigga play. Yeah, I hate that about Brandon Roy. Cause that nigga was wet, boy. Yeah, Brandon Roy was nice. Um, Derrick Rose too. Derrick yeah. Rose is the the best basketball player I've ever seen. You keep the most ball. Athletic guard you I keep Derrick Rose with, with no good knees, emotion. boy. It was over with. Yeah. Boy. His layup package. I'm going to have to go with Penny Hardaway now. Oh, man. Penny was. I'm, out of all the players we named, Penny Hardaway the best player I've ever seen. Like, Penny Hardaway literally beat Michael Jordan two straight years in NBA All Star votes. And people forget that shit. Penny Hardaway shoot one year so more than Jordan's. Penny Hardaway, yeah. Penny Hardaway was more popular than Michael Jordan for about a year and a half easily. Like, Penny. That doll and shit, bro, with Chris Rock playing that voice, oh, yeah, that doll yeah, in that commercial, yeah. bro. Like we, we, I, I like Brandon Roy and Derrick Rose and all of them. Penny Hardaway though, he, it's a move that go. I showed Cup, I showed you that time. Oh, what that nigga did that spin Brandon, shit. Brandon, like, I've never seen back, yeah. nobody else do that shit in the NBA, and then he did that shit in like 1995 or some shit. Swear to yeah, God, that was crazy. Never seen a nigga do that move before. Penny Hardaway. Probably had the most complete man, game. from '93 to '96. He was that nigga. He though. was that nigga. Came in as him. Yeah. Like as him, him, like and Derrick Rose did too. All these guys y'all naming Brandon Roy, all of them came in. The only person that can, all right, if we're gonna go like that, Derrick Rose is the only person that can stand with that nigga like that. Yeah, but, 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 but we can't say Brandon Roy was the second most popular player in the NBA at, at, at any time. No, 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 I'm not saying only Derrick Rose can Penny stand Hardaway with Penny was. Hardaway. Penny, nigga, we didn't even know that nigga real name till his third year in the league. Facts. I did not know that nigga name, name was Anthony. Anthony. <laughs> <laughs> we didn't even know he was that popular, bro. Nigga name was Anthony. Well, I, 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 I didn't know that to the day. Come on, <laughs> man. <laughs> Penny, what's my Penny, nigga? Like, I, 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 I yeah, threw yeah. shoes in with this nigga. Yep. Yeah, man, come on, man. Them kicks. Yeah. And I ain't saying the Hardaways were more popular than Jones, but I'm just saying, nigga, hey, you had one or two players. He had you know, we were so little. Game. Like, he had a drop 30. Penny Hardaway and Tim Hardaway. He could do the no look. Like, that how deep he thought about basketball. That nigga, that nigga was Magic Johnson, Michael Jordan, all rolled He's, in he one. He was the first stretch point guard. Yeah. First. Since Magic Johnson. Made first. that shit cool. I ain't gonna lie, Grant Hill would have Grant Hill was nice. No, see, before he got injured. Grant Hill, what you call him? He he was LeBurn, but he had a he had a little bit of KD in it to him, too, though. Yeah. But he played defense, though. That was some big guard. Like when he, he went to my, when he went to Orlando, if he would have never been hurt when he went to Orlando, matched up with T Mac, a no never hurt T Mac. That mm -hmm. shit would have been problems right there in Orlando. Yeah. Yeah. But both of them got hurt. Yeah, Grant Hill was hell too. I can't take that away from Grant. But we're not gonna act like we didn't see Derrick uh, Rowe go down that damn lane on um got them <laughs> Dwayne Wade and LeBron James make them look like shit. Yeah, we, yeah, you're right. Yeah. This nigga been good, man, but I just say Penny, second year, I think second or third year, you're in the finals. 
Shit, man. Penny was just a good Kobe. Stop this shit, man. He was just a good Stop this shit, man. He was just a good as Kobe. Third year in the final, man. Stop this shit, man. I mean, he was good as Kobe. Like, he was better than Kobe his first three years in the league. His first three years are way better than Kobe. But if he didn't get still. injured, though, I, 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 I could have did, him and Shaq could have did the hey, same now. damage now. That's easy. God damn it. Now, that, we got to talk. <laughs> I'm just being real hey, now. I love goddamn Penny you know, you know, you got to think about it, though. Kobe, Kobe... He, he he didn't he he one dimensional like he he gonna go out there and kill you. Penny could kill you in scoring, passing. No, I can't put him under Kobe now. You said one dimensional. I know, no, I'm saying so. So, so Kobe passed the ball. I didn't say one dimensional. No, yes, you, you, you said Shaq? Kobe, but he went he went he, he, he went dishing that shit like Penny. Though, so he, he went dishing that shit to Shaq. Not like Penny, man. Man, Shaq not like Penny. Penny, Penny would Penny was doing them. So he went dishing shit to all goddamn man. Y'all man, y'all go watch the highlights. Man, he fat nigga. What? I mean, no, he's no, he's not a passer like I'm Penny. Just, I'm just saying, like, but Penny's Penny not a sniper a, like Kobe. He gave no, you a different ain't, way. He ain't no sniper like Kobe. No, not Kobe. Now, you're not going to just give Penny the ball and say, go do work on that. Nah, fuck, yeah, never. No, you're not going to say that. that you're not going to say that. In the first three years, you could. No. No, you can say, go, get, <laughs> go out there and ball, but you're not going to tell him, go out there and get that work. Kobe can go get that work. I mean, I, I'm a, I'm a, I'm a, and I just say, I think Penny the best one. But we can't, Penny only ever said 10 points his first year, bro. I'm going to keep this shit. It's 21 second year, 20, I think like 23 to second year. I would never. On but this uh, you, you see, it, 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 Kobe it was, it was going Brian. up though by the years, what I'm saying. I seen the nigga drop 40 on Mike. Yeah, I seen a lot of niggas drop 40. But on I just, Mike. I seen, on I seen Mike. Kobe Bryant drop 55 on Mike. Man, Mike was 40 years old. Yeah, but then how old he was? He was out nah, there with his gym shorts on. He was out there suited and booted. Hey, man, I, okay. okay. He ain't, ain't, ain't stood up to the challenge? Yeah. Okay. Mike wasn't running. All right, all right, I get it. Yeah, I mean, see, you think, man, quit playing. Oh, okay, okay, I'm not gonna say. Okay, is Kobe Bryant better than than Dominic Wilkins? Yes. Okay, I watched him Dominic drop 55 on Mike. We can go to the next subject though. We got to act like Mike just never got points. No, I didn't say that. I just why well, I just prime. said Penny dropped 40 on him. I, mean, I ain't shit. Every great player get points dropped yeah. on him. Well, don't you ever disrespect Kobe being Brian? Man. <laughs> and ain't nobody disrespect him, man. Yeah, but Penny was Kobe. a goddamn. I'm saying, scoring while he, I'm saying, scoring while he Penny didn't see. get injured, right? And Penny him and Shaq got nice. along. They could have did the same. Penny not they could have won a couple rings together. Yeah, I, yeah, yeah, I, yeah, I agree with that. But I, Penny not saying. Like really, them splitting up, shit, and Penny, him getting injured, that probably helped Mike to bro, win the next three. Bro, you're not giving Penny's not seeing Kobe Brian offensively, bro. I'm just gonna be honest. Nah, I ain't saying that. He's not even in the same stratosphere. I just can't. But you don't. But you don't know. His full potential, how good he would have got. You talking about his first three seasons? It, because you figure past his first three seasons, the Kobe didn't even really play his first three seasons. Yes, he did because he, he went to the Oscar in his second year. Okay, but his numbers weren't penny numbers. He came off the bench. They didn't want to get rid of Eddie Jones. Kobe Brown was better than Eddie Jones the second year. But I'm just, I'm just saying easily penny, better than Eddie Jones. Well, Penny was better than him in his first three. Did years. Did you ever see Kobe Brown chewing that gun, bro? Bro, Once he I started know, chewing listen, that gun, do you know what's going on? I know Kobe. Kobe, listen, Kobe <laughs> is probably, Kobe is probably, the greatest, Kobe probably is the greatest guard behind Michael Jordan to me. You know what I'm saying? I'm not taking He ain't behind him. Mike. He's, he stands cat a corner to Michael Jordan. <laughs> no, nigga. Like, Mike no, is you're right. tripping. Like, this is, no, this no, is Mike. You're tripping. This is Kobe. Like, no, no, you're tripping. Like, no, you're tripping. Mike, there's a little bit of hell on. You're on. tripping. That's a little bit. No, you're tripping. That's a little bit. Sorry, sir. Mike played against cocaine snorters and alcohol. Now, we want to be for real about Mike's competition. Mike's now, competition now, did now. drugs. Hold on, wait a minute, wait a minute, wait, hold on, 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 hold Kobe played the exact way he mirrored a nigga and won five rings. He said it on the last day, right, right. if it wasn't for Mike, yeah, what? he wouldn't have five fucking lied. rings. You know what? He ain't lied. But you didn't tell the whole truth. You're right. Kobe got five rings playing against sober ass niggas on steroids. Mm -hmm. Jordan got six rings well, three of them playing Shaq, against well, alcoholics. Well, but three, but three, but three of them and was with the, already throwing but, games. But three in of the them NBA. was with hold up. But three of them was with the most dominating player in the NBA, Shaq. We and, just talked and about Michael that. Michael Jordan got six with Scottie Pippen. But Scottie Pippen went. And, and, but Scottie and, Pippen went. So, but, but, but Scottie Pippen went no dominating player like Shaq. So I got, I got a question. Yeah, Dennis Rodman, the most greatest yeah. rebounder of all. So, so not for the first. Three, Jason, the last Jason, three. Last three. Jason Tatum mirrored Kobe. Yeah. So what, what going on? Nah, nah, they don't. He mirrored him with certain moves, but I'm talking about no, bro. Kobe played exactly no, no. like Mike. 
Ka- you know what? <laughs> Devin Booker oh, fans, they like Kobe right now. I'm talking about to the point. To the point, this nigga chew gum, talk like him in interviews. My bro, this nigga had this nigga down to a T. So Kobe. This shit went beyond back So much you're telling me Kobe's good enough to mirror the God. But, right. those, but he's not. Other niggas ain't good enough God. to mirror him. That was like so that's what, what you're telling so me. Again? Kobe's good enough to mirror what we consider God in, in correct, in correct, issues. correct. Mm-hmm. But the rest of these niggas ain't even good enough to mirror him. No. Mm-hmm. Shit. So that, that I Coco say play these just like are Kobe. Kobe. You will corner. never see Jordan. Jordan, Jordan, uh, Jordan and on Kobe. cocaine. Um, whatever the, the hype drugs. At the moment was alcohol. Niggas, Ben Baker was drinking liquor during halftime, bro. Do not tell me these niggas was all out there giving it that. All right. I'm saying is a nigga played the exact same. This I mean, father married him a nigga played through exactly a series, the same bro. way Michael Jordan played and won five rings. This is, so that lets me know that Mike could have played in any era. For anybody who want to say, oh, the Kobe could have played in that era. What you think Kobe would have played in that era? Huh? What you think Kobe would have I didn't say he couldn't have. So that's the point. But we don't know how he would play if he was right, with come on, Dylan. Like, come on, come on. Jay. We don't know how Mike would have played. We don't know how no, Mike would No, Mike play. played the way he played before Kobe even existed. But I mean, he could have did what he did in that era. In, in the Kobe's East, era. I, I had a quick question for you. In, in the East, all them first three rings. Let's let go to second three rings. Who was the best shooting guard Michael Jordan went against in the East? Reggie Miller. Uh, that's the best you can do? Spot up shooter. That's the best you can Reggie do Miller as Reggie Miller? was a nice shooter. That, I mean, that's that's the best you can do as Reggie Miller? You said shooter. Who, I no, that's a shooting guard. I oh, said shooting, shooting guard. guard. Who was the best shooter. shooting guard? Don't say no like John said, Starks shooter. and Reggie Miller. That's the competition coach. That's the best. That's my point, what I'm saying. If you say Reggie Miller, that's the best competition. Michael I thought you Trump. said shooter. It don't matter. matter. It don't matter. It's what you, mean? you hold on a shooter. I said name the best shooting guard in Michael Jordan's position that he played against coming out of the East. Period. And if you can't name nobody, my point is that's the competition that he's trying to sit up here and name to you. You gonna sit up and say John Starks, motherfucker ain't in the Hall of Fame. I didn't say John Starks. I mean, who? Reggie Miller. Wait, wait, wait. What you talking about? The first three or the last three? Any one of them, G. He, he played. He, play, he, he played against Penny. That was a great shooting guard. He's a point no, he was. He's a point guard. guard. Nick Anderson was a shooting Nick, guard. Nick, Nick Nick Anderson was, was a two guard. G. Come on, bro. Stop reaching, bro. Like, he didn't play against no fucking body. He, he's right. The, the, well the, the main you. knock on Michael Jordan. My bad, G. My bad. Let me get the top. The main knock on Michael Jordan, and even Cup know this because he be on social media, that everybody hold on to this is a LeBron fan. And don't get it twisted. I think Michael Jordan the greatest player of all time. Because I know if he won all them scoring titles shooting jumpers, he could do that shit in any era. I give you that. But the main knock is... Cup, you see it, is what? The competition he fucking played against. He ain't against. playing against nobody. He ain't playing. That's what they say every time. He played against a bunch of plumbers and motherfucking and but shit the, like but, that. But wasn't the game played different? They had the hand check. You I'm get- asking you one question. Who is the best shooting guard in the East that he had to go through? Michael Jordan. That's all I'm asking. And if you can't name nobody but Reggie Miller, that's the best you can do. Kobe had to go against Dwayne Wade. Kobe Bryant. No, no, you're against. talking about, in, about in, in the Western Conference who he had to go against. Anybody, anyone who was the who, who was Clyde the, Drexler, who you want to name? Rich, Mitch Richmond? Clyde like, Drexler, them, they was in Jordan era too. I don't want to say I said, oh, the best no, shooting guard. No, I ain't talking about I'm talking about who did Kobe, what shooting guard, what great shooting guards did Kobe go through in the Western Conference? Brandon when he was winning Murray. championships. Oh, who cool. got down. Shit, but you finna go, go down. Ahead. No, go ahead. We got Brandon Roy, we got Tracy McGrady. We got Tracy McGrady was in the Eastern Conference. No, bro. that nigga played for the Houston Rockets, Rockets too. G. Come on, yeah, Ginobili. Ginobili, one. You got which beat Kobe Bryant? Because Ginobili came off the bench. Half yeah, the time. and then so if you just go across the league, Dwayne Wade, motherfucking. Oh, don't get it twisted. I mean, we had to say who got to guard both ways: LeBron James, because they always guarded each other. Right. Yeah. And, and 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 when they played against each other, because they always used to go at it. Whatever. Allen Iverson. Ray what, Allen. Ray Allen. Uh, Paul, Paul Pierce. Paul Pierce. Uh, Mike uh, played against all these same people. No, he, no, he didn't. He didn't play against Al Iverson. Come on, Paul the Pierce. Wizards. They were boys. No, he still. played against Al Iverson. I was a hey, We can't count. Oh yeah. No, yeah, we yeah. can't count. Hey, like, they were still <laughs> boys to Jordan. Just like Kobe was still a boy. All these niggas we named came in the league with at the uh, uh, with Kobe. Okay, okay. I'm, they all in the same draft. Okay. Oh, Kerry Kittles. Nigga, he can name a Mello. list of machine guards. Carmelo Anthony. And he Carmelo said Mello Anthony. was the hardest nigga. One of the other hardest niggas for him to guard. Shit. Carmelo was strong. Oh, and then, 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 you talking about Braves on the Nuggets, Mello. And J.R. Smith. And, when and, he was and, and even Michael Jordan said on the last dance, I was playing with a bunch of coke snorters when I came into the room. That's all I seen was white cocaine. That's Michael Jordan's fucking words. He is. Yeah. Quit. Well, we gotta stop holding on to this fact like this nigga was just. Oh, like we can't say nothing about this nigga. 
Like, nice. Can't, can't send in the Michael ball. Jordan played against a lot of a lot of the talent that he played against. Like I say, once again, because he shot jumpers and he was smart, I know he could have played it in the era. All I'm saying is those six rings and shit. We can't just say he would have got him in this era with these niggas. Hey, it's hard for LeBron to get one. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. It's hard. Like, like now we can't go back and change shit. Michael Jordan cement is dry. He earned that shit. He deserved that shit. So that's the shit that I based the shit on. But hey, Kobe tell somebody won five in the, he won five in the era though, and he so lost two. He lost that, two. Times. Okay. I he won five in what era? I, I, I'm just saying in his era. He no, won. no, just a minute ago you say he had Shaq the most dominant player. So don't say he won not five now. He won now. three so of them. He won Shaq. two then. He yeah, just you, won two. You, in, your, in your eyes, Kobe's only good for two. Yeah, that's what you just said a minute ago. So don't fix your argument now to say, well, he won but five. No, but I also say, I said he won five rings mirroring Michael Jordan the way he played. So that, that's like that's what that lets me know that Mike could have possibly did the same thing in their era too. You know what I hate? I hate that mirroring shit. Everybody did, takes though. something from somebody else's game. I didn't game. say that, no. But Nobody know, has came in the NBA with a pure, it's, 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 pure, it's, 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 a pure that, game. That, that, that like, this is all, all this shit I'm doing right now, I, I came up with. Only, no, only, 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 there is only, no only, nigga only, in the only, NBA only got thing, that. No, good only, good only good thing that I seen Kobe probably look a little different than Mike on his ball handling skills and, and shooting the three. Okay, I'm going to say shit that's just going to complete. Kobe Bryant came in better than Mike skill-wise. Period. We Mike couldn't, Mike couldn't dribble the... Oh, no, no, because you're simply saying he married his game. Mike could not dribble the ball and handle the ball like Kobe Bryant did coming in. Mike shot 17% from the fucking from the three-point line. Kobe Bryant came in like that from three. Let's not forget, for about 10 years, Kobe Bryant held the record for most threes in the fucking game. Kobe Bryant, not Steph, not, not Clay Thompson and Steph Curry, Kobe Bryant did. My, Kobe came in as a better player, even only averaged seven, seven points a fucking game his rookie year, far skill-wise, than Mike ever came in like that. Mike was strictly drive to the basket and got down, uh, uh, try to get a dunk or a layup. That's the reason why I he couldn't be. Said Mike oh, let, me fin- let me finish. Let me, let, me fin- let, me, let, me, let me finish. That's what Mike was. Kobe came in like that with them Jays and jumpers and shit like that. You know what I'm saying? The reason why Mike developed the jump shot because his old ass couldn't take that fucking beating. The, the fadeaway didn't start until he came back from fucking playing baseball. Am I lying? Yep. You know what I'm saying? And the fadeaway didn't start until then. Mike's whole game became fadeaway or head fake and go up under do layups and shit like that. Wait, anticipate wait anticipated Jordan Dunk or, 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 yes. or some type of... Yes. We but, anticipated those. But, but, but mirroring his game and shit, Kobe came in like that Kobe, in 96. Kobe's game changed too as he got Older. He Doing was what? In the post. He what? He was more in the post. Kobe used to come through the lane and shit. Kobe too. was in the post starting off, G. He was in the post shooting fadeaways off top in 96. First round, 13th pit, went to Charlotte, then got traded for Belida Devo to go to the Lakers. First, off top when he came in, he was like that. He was better than Eddie Jones, just that Eddie Jones had to start because of his contract. Kobe Bryant went to the All Star game that year, his second year okay. in the NBA. He was like that, my nigga. Jordan wasn't like that. He was just unstoppable driving a fucking basketball. And he damn sure couldn't handle it like that. Not like Kobe could. Not off top, he couldn't. You know what I'm saying? Now, after a while, Jordan became like that with shooting and shit like that. He was that good at driving the basketball. But we can't slip in and say, oh, just because he mirrored his game like that, he wasn't like that. He was like that, man. That nigga was like that. And, and I'm not saying Jordan couldn't play in the air. We know he could. If you could shoot a jumper from 17, you could shoot a jumper from 17 anywhere. 80s, 90s, 70s, 60s, 50s. I know Mike with a ball. All I'm saying is we can't add like the level of competition would not have stopped Mike from getting rings. You got, exactly. you, got, you, got you got the best six, you got the best wingman in the league on your team, the best rebounder in the league on your team, and the best three, and the best six man coming off the bench on your team. Cool coach, Pippen, Rodman. Just think about that. Every time Jordan was in the finals, let me. Now I'm going to tell you who the shooting guard and the small four is, so you'll know who's switching off. Okay, the first one was with um, the Lakers, right? Yeah. So you got Byron Scott and you got James Worthy. James Worthy got hurt, man. Okay, then you got Michael Cooper. You got, right. got one of them. Goofy. My boy going crazy. Okay, so. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Like, that, 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 God damn. That, that shit all right. Now, that yeah, shit kind of right. No, I, was, I, was, I, was, I didn't expect you to okay. know that. You know what I'm saying? Second year. We got got them Clyde Glide Dressler. We got Jerome Kersey. Yeah. Not bad. And uh but but kind of whatever name is, yeah. Yeah, we got some other goofy ass. Danny Ainge. He was on the team too. Danny yeah. Ainge played for them. Okay, so then okay, now we're going to the uh what the, the Phoenix Suns. We got Thunder Dan. Thunder Dan. We, we got got down uh who they small. Ch- oh, Chambers, I think, was over. No, nah, Chamber was the center. Got yeah, down. Yeah, yeah. Switching Kevin off. Kevin Johnson. Kevin Johnson, Johnson. Yeah. yeah. Switching out. You know, who who uh Cedric Sabalos. Cedric Sabalos now. Yeah, anybody who who can get their ass down there in time. Okay. All them niggas garbage. I just seen stuff Clyde dress. <laughs> <laughs> no, nah, my Cooper ain't garbage either, Kai. You know, we gonna the Lakers nigga ain't garbage. Kai. They did their thing in their years. But the rest of them niggas garbage. Okay, now we're going to that second goddamn go around. 
Uh, now, now Hershey Hawkins. He can shoot. Hershey Hawkins. I Hershey, forgot about Hershey, 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 Hershey Hawkins. Hershey Hawkins, yeah. And that lift strip. That okay. Lift strip. Hey, uh, athletic bone in these niggas. No, 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 no. It was Nate McMillan. But and that's Hershey the strip with the started. That's the with the with the small four. Yeah, start small four yeah. and Hershey. I'm and talking Hershey, about the yeah, 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 yeah. in case they switch. You yeah, know, gotcha, gotcha, some gotcha, shit gotcha, like that. Gotcha. I'm just naming. Yeah, I'm just showing you all these non-athletic ass niggas I'm naming right now. But you ain't lying, but goddamn. Okay, two years you had to play the Utah Jazz. I shouldn't even have to name nobody on that because nobody knows what nobody but starting them alone. But I know Ostertag, you know Byron Rose, he got this goofy Jeff, ass pushed Jeff off Horn, two years in a row. Jeff Horner said. Horny? No, they used to call that nigga Horny. Horny? Horny. Horny. No. These are the niggas Mike was playing against, bro. Horny. Oh, no, none of these niggas. Exactly. But Jeff Horner nigga said, going crazy. Jeff right Horner said looks like the guy that got down brings me my gloves at work. <laughs> That's what I'm telling you. And I work at a transmission place. <laughs> Kobe played against real athletes. He had to, he had to fight Chris Charles. That nigga went in Kobe shit. <laughs> no, remember, no, remember, listen, no, remember the top. Remember now, the, no, no, remember now. The, 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 the top fifty was in Jordan era. They just added twenty five on more. Yeah, but let's be real, the top fifty is based off respect. But nigga, they put Bill Walton in the top fifty. His ass only played like two years in the NBA after a foot fucking injury. Like, you know I mean? They went off his college They put stats. Pistol Pete in the top 50, bro, and his NBA career wasn't shit. But it's a lot of niggas, I'm talking about in Jordan era, that was on no, the I'm USA just saying what, team. I, I, what I'm saying okay. is, admit to that. It's okay. a lot of niggas in the top 50 that they put in there off of respect because they true. played early. That's true, but I'm just saying, they like, do that shit over again. the good ones was in Jordan era. If you go down line from Dave Robinson, Patrick Ewan, Charles Barkley, we just keep naming do that you, top do, 50. But do you understand you know, why they call it the top? Hold on, hold on. Yeah, I got this. You know what I'm talking about? They named the top 50. Why? Because the league was only 50 years old. Oh, they got no choice but to put them in there. <laughs> okay. now, now you know they what, got no choice but to put you know them in there. I, I will tell you this. In Jordan's era, the only good play, good players were on the dream team. And you need to take off Christian Leitner and then put Isaiah Thomas on. And those are all the good good players. Oh, no, no, no. You, not, those are all that's the that's good. Don't, don't forget. That, that, Dominique. It. Okay, that's Dominique. Dominique. Dominique and, and um, Isaiah Thomas are the only yeah, good players left out there. They're stars right there. That's all they had, the NBA had, though. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. yeah facts. That Twelve was it. players. We out of thirty, out of thirty man NBA league, 30, 30 team NBA league. You know what I'm saying? Thirty. Twelve players, man. But, but you go get the US. And and it, ain't no, it ain't number two players that I, was supposed to be on that no. team. My bad, Skeet. Mm -hmm. Two players need to be on that team. He just said Dominique Wilkins and Isaiah Thomas. Yeah. Other than that, nobody else deserves to be and on. And I can, I can, I can take off. Of, shit, Judge Stockton and. A old ass Larry Bird and a, a, a old ass Magic Johnson. And, and let's not talk about Larry Bird. Only played about three games that in that dream team because his back was fucked up. Yeah, you go back true. and watch the footage. He's on the ground with the fucking ice pack on his back. He couldn't play. Let's be real now. Shaq was supposed to be on there, but he was a rookie. I was just about to say that. We, we got, hey, they, 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 they did hold up, but they did put Shaq in the top fifty though before they came out with the top seventy. Yeah, because he, he had, had, no lead, they had no choice. He had no choice. He'd been in the league six years, four years by then. Yeah. 92 to 96, top 50, the greatest 50 came out of 1996. All we're saying is, bro, Mike then, he, his, his competition was suspect. No, we got to understand, there's a such thing called marketing. Mm. Like, we can market some shit the way we want it to look because that's what we got to do because we're branding the NBA. So we got to build this nigga up. It's just like with wrestling. Like, I don't know how many people watch wrestling. I know Cub watch wrestling. I watch wrestling. Like, you got to build it, up a superstar. You make folks want to watch that shit. Like they built up LeBron. You know, look, not not saying LeBron ain't good, but right. they built him up because the East had nothing, and they know this this nigga gonna keep he gonna keep going, but he can't beat nobody we got in the West though. So we're gonna build LeBron as that nigga because he keeps coming out that LeBron, out of that side. LeBron kept getting his ass whooped so much they changed the rules to the All Star game to oh we get to pick our team now. Facts. Damn. They, they changed the rule of the All-Star game. I mean, that's it, that's it is a They're fact. going back to the regular one now this year. Yeah. You know, they're going back to the East, East West, West. Yeah. But that's the reason why they did that. Level now. But yeah. at first, shit, that shit look, that shit was looking bleak out there. That's right? all I'm saying, bro. Like, like I, I get it. Like, a jumper is a jumper. Mike can that's shoot and ball in any era. I believe Michael Jordan in this era would score more points than he did in the eras before. Because he ain't had no hand check in this era. He And also because of the rules. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. I believe that Cole Harley. But that don't mean that he's going to win six championships against these niggas when I got niggas like Steph what? Curry, six foot three, shooting 40 foot fucking jump shots, bro. That is not for the nigga. I got nigga six eleven. You name one nigga in Michael Jordan era who was six eleven that could shoot a tray from thirty five foot like Kevin Durant and Brandon Ball. Yeah, I can name niggas that Mike got his game from. George Gervin, 
Dr. The J. J. Which he said that in the last game. Dr. Like, J was my guy. He, he got his niggas that he, you could tell he, Jordan. He mirrored he, I think he mirrored no, he too. don't like Dr. J. I don't think they had a similar game. Though. Finger roll. Jordan, what we call the Jordan reverse, that long Afro nigga was Finger doing eight. in the ABA. I'm, I'm, I'm just talking about the, the actual skill set. Like, that was a part like of his him skill Kobe, set before he started doing the jumper. Hand in hand just with the, I'm talking about just with I the mean, way they actually. Yeah, Jordan's. Stole dunks, try to do free throw, rock cradle like Doc J. All I'm just talking about the actual game. I, I get, I get under the back. I'm, I'm just talking about the no, actual I get, game. I get, I get what you're saying. I, I just believe that, bro. Some of these players become so mythical that we that we forget. Like the game got to be played, bro. Yeah. We seen Mike lose to Penny Hardaway in the first in the second round, bro. I just think, I don't care about that shit. He came back from basketball and football. I mean, from baseball, baseball and all yeah. that shit. We seen Mike lose to the to, to the Pistons, bro. He, he's not finna go against. Dwayne Wade, Sam Games, and think he's gonna get the same shit he was doing the goddamn Reggie Miller. It's not gonna happen. You finna get this shit too on the other end. I ain't. Hey. You know what I'm saying? Like yeah. I did. I got Shaq back here with me. You telling me Dwayne Wade, them that team with Antoine Walker, uh, White Chocolate, and all them boys. One White Chocolate out there, and all them boys Gary ain't Payne. gonna be Gary Payne ain't comparable to beat the the uh, the first round. I mean, the, nah, I ain't gonna say the first round. That second round bull team when when with Rodman back fucked up and Scottie Pippen got migraines and shit. Shit, they got to see them. They got to see them, man. You know what I'm saying? That's all I'm saying. And and the big three Celtics with Paul Pierce in his prime, Kevin Garnett and Ray Allen. Shit, I'm you got to see them, man. You know what I'm saying? That's all I'm saying. Now you talk about Kobe and Shaq. No, you got to see Kobe with Paul and Andrew Bynum with Kobe. With Looking at them looking like, boy, y'all ain't gonna make me not be who I am, nigga. <laughs> I told that nigga down there in Miami, I'm finna win some rings without his ass. Yeah, yeah, that's true. You know what I'm saying? But I mean, we, we went too long on that one. Let's keep it moving, man. That's a good subject though. You know what I'm saying? Um I'm trying to see which way I want to go with this. Man, um look. Alabama mayor kills himself after being outed at a transgender uh Curvy girl. We ain't got to stay on this for long. I'm just going to say this and I'll let y'all cook. Hey, man, be you, man. If be you, yourself. Be yourself. If you have to, if you're embarrassed by anything that you do, then don't do it. If, you, if you're scared of what the backlash going to do, then don't do it. Stand on whatever the fuck you going to do. That's yeah, all that's I'm going to say. That's a fact. You know what I'm saying? Like, like, look here. I like a bitch to lick my nipples. Come on, bitch. Suck on this nipple. I'm good. You know what I'm saying? I don't give a shit. <laughs> I like is... to, I'm just being honest. I like a bitch to lick my balls. I'm cool with that. You want to lick them balls, baby? Go lick them balls, baby. You know what I'm saying? Go on down there. I like, I like the film sometimes. I'm like this right here. That's what I like to do. You know, it ain't the problem with that Like people got a problem with the alphabet. The problem is when you try to hide that you're a part of the alphabet. Yeah. Mm -hmm. That's yeah. the only... Cool, don't be your fucking self, sure. bro. Can't nobody judge you for being yourself. I, I just think he just, probably, he just probably thought he was in such a position... That he couldn't have no flaws on himself, mm. and it, it it drove him crazy trying to hide it. But like you said, I agree. I agree. Be yourself, man. I don't think that man should have so took his many, own life. That's why I don't see. This, that's why that shit's contradictory. Okay, right. Okay. With so many rules about bullying, and you should accept this. All of this stuff, you should be accepting. Mm -hmm. But the niggas in power, or the niggas with a with some clout, that's like that. Don't want to be known as that. Mm. Dwight. That, that, we, now I can get you, Dwight, because they shouldn't have brought it up. <laughs> well, you brought it there up. There is <laughs> no way in hell you're seven feet, no, six foot 12. Now I'm going to be actual with this. Act. You're six foot 12. You're swole as hell. Six foot 12. 12. <laughs> I knew when Shawty when didn't want to be married to his animal, I said, yeah, that, she don't want to be your beard, cuz. <laughs> <laughs> she don't see what you be doing behind that clothes though. And I think she like them girls too. Cause she play for the Spars. And I be seeing her and her little team. Goddamn, they they she turned tough up. Too, they she turned up. Tia they, Cooper, right? Yeah, they, oh, she, they turned. They the tough. whole clip yeah. turned up. Tia, right? you come know on the show. Saying? Come on the show. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I, I, I just think I just think that it's it's like with, with, with the mayor, him rerunning. That was gonna conflict with that. Yeah, I think. Oh, they gonna the, bring that up now. Yeah, you know what I'm saying. I think with the white. It was him trying to get back in the NBA, but locker he, room hazard. No, like, no, 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 like no, 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 no. shit like that. Them I think. niggas knew in the NBA. And they said, hey, man, that nigga strong. <laughs> <laughs> I ain't, I ain't no. But you know what I'm saying? You got to think. Who wanna, who, all right, hey, hey. Pause. This whole, everything I'm about to say, we're going to pause. So pause. I ain't got to say pause when I, cause I'm not going to remember. Yeah. Who the fuck going to let Dwight got? Who going to back down Dwight? <laughs> 
that, but, but that's what that, I'm that's saying. The, no, that's the number crazy. one question. Are you going to go in the shower that, with Dwight? That ain't, that's the question. You're the slanger of the it year. Ain't, it ain't. You're it ain't. the slanger of the year, cuz. Are what you I'm going saying. in there? See, but that's that's the question. It's 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 do it's do me paying Steph you 30, 30 to forty a year. Hey, man, do he want to be in the locker room with, with Dwight? Dwight? Yeah. It no. ain't about it's your it's your. Hey. It ain't, who going to back him down? That's your issue. That's about after yeah. Seth come true, off the true. screen. Say Dwight, he set the screen for Seth. Seth comes off the screen. Splash. You know that's what he do. Then you want a good game me? No, cuz. No, you can't good game but, me. But that's what I'm saying. You that's cannot the stop these cheats, bro. It, but that, but that's, <laughs> that's the issue. It ain't about <laughs> who going to back him down because cause guess what? If I put the white out there and you decide not to go, you know, take this too. Yeah. Hey, I ain't got nothing to do with me. On the merit, look, just be you. But I would have looked. Yeah, the mayor be you. I know we got off. You could. But bro. look, but here's my thing. I, I just understand in today's time, mm -hmm. um, why why people are not being themselves because it's acceptable now. It was a time, you know, where stuff like this, bro, wasn't acceptable, and yeah. you really had to like hide. stay yeah, in the yeah, closet. You had to hide it for real. I, so I don't understand, like in today's time, you know, why people that shit politics. Well, with him, with him, I, okay. everything you saying cool. Yeah. I ain't giving you no pushback on that, but I think he had a family and he had kids and shit like that. And I think that was the issue. He didn't want them to know, you know what I'm saying? Stuff like that. That he, makes sense because you don't want double, to affect your kids and stuff. They getting, or yeah. whatever, you know what I'm saying? But anyway, uh, RP man, that's, that's, that's a fucked up situation. I, I say condolences. Condolences, family, yeah, condo you know? yeah, man. Because that is some messed up stuff. Like you feel like you can't be yourself for real. You gotta take yourself out this yeah. shit. Look at Dwight. He's still here. He don't give a damn. Shit, he taking niggas. This <laughs> nigga, what we got you, man? I know we got <laughs> uh, Dwight. Red oh, nigga. No, I don't even know if I'm saying this right. Uh, don't, don't worry about the girl. The why? Okay, I got yeah, you. Yeah, don't I got worry you. about that. All right, well. Before we get out of here, man. Um, no, we got a couple though. No, we don't. But well, we got we got to get on that bay ball. Oh, I'm just about to say that. Okay, okay. I'm saying yeah. I got I got one more after that. But go ahead. Oh, okay, okay. So you hide you hit uh, one. No, no. I, but go ahead. Go ahead. All right. Why nobody don't care about baseball no more? Hey man, I asked y'all. I asked y'all this shit about two weeks ago, man. <laughs> go ahead. I'm listening. I asked y'all this shit. I said, man, ain't nobody said shit about the World Series, man. Nobody. I didn't, Before, I, hey, man, was I didn't even man, know it was. Look, look here, man. I knew it was over from baseball when they had thick ass Megan Thee Stallion out there throwing pitches and she didn't know which way to fucking face. Megan Thee Stallion then, was on baseball? She was throwing pitches. Threw an opening pitch and didn't nobody give a fuck. I'm talking about <laughs> thick as hell, facing the wrong way on purpose. Like she was facing left real? field. Yeah, she was facing real, left yeah. field with the ball that was like, turn around, babe, turn around. Thick as hell. I'm talking about that ass jiggling. Didn't nobody give a damn. What nobody. game she was at? I, I don't even I don't fucking know. know. But that's what I'm saying. Like, I, I don't know. I didn't but even. Shaw really answered the question earlier. Nobody Who? wants to watch you stand in line for your turn. Like, I'm saying, so when do when the last do time I heard about a World Series is when the Braves won, only because yeah, the it's Braves our won last year, hometown man. team is winning. You ain't the got Rangers. no touch but to hear that. Right. But the Rangers won this year. Rangers won. I, I, like the I said, I, I didn't even know the. the Hold on, so wait a minute. I didn't even know the World Series was already. It already happened. It's happened. over. Yeah, so what? Rangers won. That, that fast. Hold the fuck up. So who the fuck played? I don't know. Damn, I don't even oh, know. Rangers and backs. Yeah, Rangers and Diamondbacks. Rangers and Diamondbacks. Look, Rangers and Diamondbacks. baseball, baseball got to do better marketing. I think their game is like baseball is like the black, the the the, the underground. What that shit is? The, the the black web or something. Now it's like yeah, yeah. we black. know it's out <laughs> there. Who, who the best player in baseball? We, we know it's out there, but it's like do niggas still watch it? You know what I'm saying? Like like Acuna, the best player probably for the Braves. He like they the first player to ever do like a 70, 40, 30 or some shit, whatever. Yeah, like but he ain't, he ain't black though. He he, black. he, he Dominican. All that, he, whatever. I mean, but, I know that's black too, but I'm, what I'm you know saying he's not is, Hank Aaron. He's it's not Sosa. the nigga that we know down the street. <laughs> no, 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 no. He's semi Sosa, no. not Hank Aaron. But I, I feel like, man, baseball just too slow. I, like I like Cup said, yeah. I don't feel like niggas want to sit up and wait in line for like for for their turn. Hold on, man. Y'all, you know what I'm saying? Man. And I think that baseball just need to do better marketing. Like that just. But what can they do? Oh my God, it is. They no got a, but back in the day, man, baseball used to see commercials for the game. Bro, you wouldn't like how you seen a baseball game commercial. Shit, man. You can, you can watch YouTube and they'll show you Lakers versus this and that tonight on YouTube TV. You know what I'm saying? Man, they don't, don't play too much, man. Who? Baseball? Man, man, man. But like, I said they used to do that. Like baseball, you would know when the Braves. How the fuck yeah. the World Series happened and ain't nobody said nothing about no World Series. I ain't hear nothing. Nobody. nobody cares about baseball. Man, them folk got rappers throwing pitches, man. They had 50 cent out baseball, there in the Yankees. Uh, look, uh, little dirt through for the Cubs. Like they they, they, they trying, y'all. And y'all need to stop that first pitch shit. 
I'm gonna tell you, and I'll tell you why I say that shit. Because the first pitch is bigger than y'all game. Mm. Damn. It is. When Stephen A. Smith throw out the first pitch, and I know that shit, but I don't know who the fuck he threw out the first pitch for, you just don't even do first pitches no more. How the, how, how the hell they have a World Series? And World Series be more than one game. Yeah. Nobody know, man. That shit Nigga, I go to work every Monday. Hey, let me tell you something. I don't know about anywhere else, but in the South, when you work at a warehouse, People play boards and all that type shit. So niggas talk about sports every fucking day. Ooh. And I work with Mexicans. I ain't heard one of them talk about no man, goddamn fuck, baseball. Hey, man, I'm fucking give a damn. One, one more the thing, man. We even talked about the World Cup. <laughs> damn sure. Now we, now, now, you might think I'm lying, but we was on that World Cup. We were on that World Cup. We had that shit on the break room. Hey, that, that was boring baseball. That's crazy as hell. I didn't even know I'm baseball. not watching shit where the score is two to one. <laughs> give a damn about, I don't give a damn about what y'all talking about. I, know, I, know, I, I, know, I ain't watching nothing. I ain't watching nothing with a box. Hey man, that shit. That, let me tell you something, man. So, let me tell you something. Soccer like that old ping pong game where you had the two shits moving like nah, that. Nah, soccer better than that. Nah, I ain't that what that shit soccer. is. That was nah, soccer. Is. Man, look here. Soccer ain't nothing but soccer ain't nothing but a bunch of goddamn foreigners running up back and forth on the, on the damn and field. sliding into each other. Why that shit be lit? Nah, I'm gonna tell you what's boring than that. No, NASCAR. NASCAR too. Okay, I'm taking three hundred left. I'm not watching no fucking. Car going yeah. 100 miles per hour, just yeah. uh, doing 30 yeah. fucking laps. Really, that's exciting. Wear their coat, What's though? exciting about that? that I, I don't jacket. know. It, when they, it, they, I'm telling you what's Maybe. exciting about NASCAR when they crash. Yeah. It, 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 it's, I hate to say it, I don't want to sound like that guy, but I think people only watch NASCAR to see them motherfucker crash. Finally, one thing though, man, what y'all think about yeah. J. Cole, Soldier Boy situation? Soldier Boy, I'm riding with you because you the first, you one of the first people that got to unfollow bad speakers, man. So I ain't gonna dish your ass on this one. Soldier boy, so, tell him. But other than that, Soldier boy, sit his ass down. Soldier man. boy, he tell him. He was tweaking a little bit. He just saying he getting to the point. Where I don't give a damn. He getting to the point. He, he trying to stay in any day. I, I, hey man, yeah. I, hey soldier, bad speakers, fuck with you, man. But we know you trying to stay relevant with that. But man. hey, yeah. this me so we can go viral, cause, cause get what you need to leave J Cole alone for he spray your ass. Cause J Cole didn't really say nothing bad, bro. Yeah, why, I, why, why, why? J Cole ain't even gonna respond. Yeah, yeah. He might respond two albums later, and we'll, we didn't know he was responding. Man, you know what? You know what J Cole gonna do? I got you, soldier. Come on, give me one of them beats. Yeah. And then J Cole say he don't even charge for verses. Nigga, you shouldn't even say nothing. Just call that nigga. Up you could have got bro. that nigga on a track. Nigga. Let's believe he getting a percentage of the song. Look, him and Wayne. Man. That's yeah, smart, but you know what? That's smart though to be like, hey, you know, I'll he don't on charge this track. for verses. Mm -hmm. But you got, but you got to he getting a percentage of the song, whatever the now, song. He said he ain't getting nothing. He, he said don't, care. He he don't, don't even care. Look, he said on Lil Yachty podcast, he do not charge nobody for verses, and he said he get on songs that he feel. Like he literally say he like he got like old what school hip hop, or he got to fuck like, with you. Yeah, he got to fuck with it. Like like, and that makes most sense because shit. A lot of times niggas be charged for these verses and get on songs and give you some bullshit. Yeah, you know what I'm look, gonna say that's cap. Look, look, I'm I'm, 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 gonna, I'm gonna give you a reason, right? Look at man, Gucci man, right now got a song with Logan fucking Paul on YouTube. <laughs> <laughs> Nobody give a damn. Why, Nobody, why you got no walk under the bus? Because that's you know that's a feature that he. But he does You ain't got to use walk. You yeah, can yeah, use yeah, anybody yeah. else. Like he, yeah. we, we don't, yeah. hey. Hey man, it, I'm equal opportunity over here, bro. Gucci man, my favorite rapper. I'd say this shit a hundred times. Sure. But, but my thing is, I don't give a damn about no nigga. That shit is what it is. You let me you charge for that shit. That was some bullshit. Let me tell you, let me tell you why I think J Cole cap. Why? He did not feel that song with him and Gucci. Ain't that that song? No, no, no. Gucci did say that they've been supposed to get in the studio for a long time, and they they should they need to get back in there. Yeah, now that song trash. That song is that song not it. But but you got to realize Gucci don't pay for verses anyway. Time, so it was nigga. free anyway. I mean, I ain't that shit was free, nigga. That he ain't give a fuck. But well, guess what, though? <laughs> it sounded free. Yeah, it, it sounded free. It sounded free. Now Jay Cole verse. J. Cole did the best he could to try to make that into something. Yeah, that shit that was trash. Soldier boy, look, man. Wop, stop, stop, stop. This and look, bro, come on. You're not getting a million dollars a verse. That's not those uh, days. Who getting a million dollars verse? Soldier boy say he, say he's, his new numbers a million dollar verse. That's you know what Soldier said. What are you gonna say on that bit? I don't know. She, she, if you think that's all. got a meal for a verse was Kodak. She, I got me some hey. baby mates. <laughs> Lloyd Banks said he charging $100 for hitting that mid-tape. Yeah, Lloyd Banks ain't nip. Cut it out. I about to say that you ain't Nipsey Hussle. Man, cut it out, out, Lloyd. We don't want to hear that shit. What they call On the Corner 3? On the Corner 3. Man, yeah, I'm a, gonna be on the I'm corner. anticipating the new Taylor Swift. I ain't standing no Lloyd. The new Lloyd Taylor Banks Swift? Trip, yeah, that's how much I feel about Lloyd Banks. Are you a Swiftie? ever compare yourself to the Are you a Swiftie? I might well be here. That nigga talking about a hundred dollars or something. When the last time you heard Lloyd Bank, bro? <laughs> On that fire song. Oh my god. Exactly. And with that being said, 
<laughs> it's your boy G Downs. It's your boy Shark. It's your boy Cup. It's your neighbor Skeet, and I need to talk to 50 Cent. You need to go talk how at your homeboys and cut them out with they bullshit. Right? Episode 108. Tune in. Yes, we'll see you guys. Hey, we next don't time. like fans. We like supporters. Cause a fan is a fake ass nigga. <laughs> <laughs> Good night. Oh, <laughs> <man, niggas. laughs>